That's mm. what it is. Mm-hmm. They won't. These men are shook to sit down with someone like me because I'm gonna ask them the questions. Nigel mm. Farage don't know about the ends. Mm, 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 he don't mm, know why these youths are going through what they. Oh, what right. does Nigel Farage me, know? Let me. Can I ask you something? I I see. I, do you know what? I am. I use Asha D as an example. That's the next. Good, very good example. Mm. He got pressured. He looked like someone had the 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 the, the, the whack to his head when mm. he was promoting the vaccine. Mm. I don't remember if you remember that video when he's there, he's all sweating. He's saying, "Yeah, it's important that the black community take the wax." Because remember, this was did the party and that he looks vulnerable to me. Mm, 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 he used to he was the one that looked. I call him central lesbian. He was the one that had a nose piercing and looked like a yellow. Mm, and mm, everyone mm. saying DMX was mad. Mm. He was telling you about Jay Z and Diddy from time. Yep, he said yep. those niggas take it, man. They take the D, mm, man. Mm, mm, they take the D, man. <laughs> yeah, yo, people, it's another episode of Truth and Bants. It's your boy Flash. And today we got my boy London from London Open TV today. <laughs> and today's episode is, I'm not even too sure about the episode <laughs> name. But what I do know is, reason I got this guy up here, because really... From what I do see from my Instagram, he's someone that just speaks his mind and he's yeah. open. And in this day and age, a lot of people aren't able to speak their mind because they're worried about maybe their job or what other people think or they're mm. trying to fit in and be likable. So this is why I got this guy because I'll be following him and I and I love I love the openness and the realness and respect, it's respect. and it's very limited <clears throat> in this time in this day and time. So really, let's get down into you and. Break it down. Who 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 is who is Mr. London? For the people that don't know. Uh, well, if we're gonna go into who am I, I think we deal with it from an Instagram perspective. Mm-hmm. So right, it's cool. more um, I deal with it as. All right, just give a quick breakdown of the people. Your where do you what, what area you come from? Okay, okay. Just so so just so they know where you're coming from when they when they see this. Yeah. Where where's the root? Where's the root? <laughs> <laughs> where's the root of this of this? <laughs> yeah. You feel me? Um, well, originally I'm from um, South London. Um, yeah. I was born in Mikesfield, but I was I mm-hmm. grew up in. Um, um, basically, Brixton, Kent, and Lambeth. I'm a Lambeth okay, boy. Say Lambeth boy, but I was in Southwark. Mm-hmm. All but, around. Because oh, my yeah. hostel was in Peckham. Mm-mm, so, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. yeah, deep okay. south, deep okay, south, okay, man. Okay, really, okay. We're from right, cool, deep cool, south, cool, man. Cool, cool, Waterloo, cool, cool. Kenton, but nothing. I'm a ridge. But Kenton, I was born in Brixton, but Kenton's my home, innit? All right, cool, cool, cool. cool. But I still rep Brixton as yeah, well. Yeah, I, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Because when I was growing up, Brixton and Kenton was one. Now there's a bit of separation with the younger, but when I was growing up, it was all just one. It was all just one, bro. So I still represent that. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, cool, cool, cool. So, how was life? How was how was life growing up? You said what? Using the hostel. Oh yeah, that was that that was sixteen still. That yeah. I moved out of my mum's when mm-hmm. I was sixteen. Mm-hmm. Um, is there a reason for that, or is that's kind of some people might say that's kind of early for moving out, um, or it just happened? Because you know, in my school there was like a thing like these girls in my school they they started to get their their hostels when we was in school. Okay. So my name was like, Ro, how did you do that? And I was like, Mm-mm. and this was some Nigerian sister. She was mm. like, all I done was forge my mum's signature. Okay, okay, okay. And so. then you, we went to this um, place called Home and Away, mm-hmm. where if you go there with a yeah. letter from your mum mm-hmm. and signed, mm-hmm. they'll put you in a hostel. Okay, okay. So me and my friends, that's what mm. we was on. Yeah, everyone, like, wanted, everyone was, wanted their space back then. <laughs> yeah, everyone days. wanted their space, but mm. most men wanted whips when mm-hmm. we first mm-hmm. left school. Yeah, but yeah, we yeah. was like, nah, man wants a place. So we got, we all, like, all, most of my friends, we all got yeah. our places from okay. young uh-uh. because we found that little loophole okay, okay, in the okay. system. And when uh-huh. I looked at my older cousins and uh-huh. uncles and stuff who get yeah. kicked out their baby mums, mm-hmm, then they're left mm-hmm. in limbo. Mm-hmm, I was yeah, like, yeah, no, nah, okay. I want to get my place from young. Yeah. <laughs> so so, so, so it weren't no that. dramatics at home. Okay, Even though okay. my mum, me and my mum did kind of clash. I was 16. But mm-hmm. when I was leaving, she was kind of upset. You mm-hmm. get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, yeah. I was still there. When yeah, I was in the hospital, back and forth, still close to my mum. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. What I mean? So it wasn't that deep. Like yeah, it that. wasn't that deep still. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, okay. So um, so you say you go, what happened? You went after, where'd you go? School, uh, college after school? Mm. Oh yeah, let me talk about school. Yeah, that's a good one as well. Yeah. I went to um, a school called um, Lee and Bailey's. Yeah. Um, basically this school was like the immigration school. Where was this? Bruv. This was in Kennerton. Oh, right, cool. 
Um, this is like the immigration school. Like, if you just come from yard, you could mm -hmm. get in this school straight away. Okay, okay. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> if you just come from wherever, you could. Like, okay. my school was like it's accepting any basically accepting anyone basically anyone. Because when I first started my school, this was the place where parents didn't want their children okay, to go. Okay, so basically it, that's the last that's the last choice. If if no one else accepts you, that's you go here. All right, because my nothing. school, it had triads, it had um, uh, uh, Jamaicans, uh, it had this that, uh -huh. and the year before I come. A, che a teacher's finger got chopped off in class. Ooh. So that's why my Mad. year only had like 55 people in it when I started. Yeah. Because no okay, one wanted okay. to send their child uh, there. Uh, 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 like uh, uh. it was proper, proper. The school okay, is okay. mad. mad, mad Liam mad. Bailey's. Big up all the old school Liam <laughs> Bailey's, man, them. They know what. What happened? So did you get in trouble? Did you get caught up in the school or what happened? Um, school. school. So like, oh. you, made it, you made it through, you made it out of there. Yeah, I met, do you know, I don't know how I made it to year 11, uh, to tell you uh, the truth. Uh, uh. I think the only reason why I made it yet to year 11, because when they tried to kick me out in year nine, because I lived near the school uh -huh. and I had bare family around the school. Yeah, so yeah, if yeah, someone yeah. punched me up, uh -huh. someone's coming down okay, the school okay, that okay, day, okay, even okay, if I okay. didn't call no one, because mm, someone told me someone uh, punched you up or all the... So, yeah, yeah. so I was very like, yeah, safe mm, in that mm, school mm, environment. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, like school was... But me, I was bad. But I weren't, I was bad. I was, I was a little shit. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I see he's got the coat. <laughs> I can't get, I was a little shit. I, I, like always kicked out, always kicked out of class mm -hmm. and all of that type of shit. Referral room. So he's a bit of a rebel. Yeah. Like in the, the classroom that we had us in here, this yeah. is crazy facts. Mm. It was the first room in, in England that a classroom had CCTV in it. Yeah. We had CCTV watching us Mad. in this classroom because they put me in a special classroom with year 11s, all the bad kids, uh, 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 but they put CCTV in there, bro. Okay. So uh, it will now I'm thinking, Mad. was that even legal? That's what I'm thinking. I don't even know if I hear that now. Not even, Stockholm Park was the next school okay. that actually brought it into multiple classrooms, but okay. our school was the first one to test mm, running. Mm, mm, so they were just watching mm, us mm, while we was, <laughs> I just think, right, all them children and they were special kids. They was oh, onto us when yeah. Mad, <laughs> mad, mad. Yeah. But I was good in school. No, yeah. I was good bunking and all that. But mm -hmm. I think cause I was more of a creative person, academically yeah. I'm all right, but yeah. I'm more like a creative person, yeah, yeah, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I'm more into art, mm -hmm, music, mm -hmm. them type of things, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, like my son's mm -hmm. more academic than I was. Okay. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just a creative, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So yeah. it's like sitting down for out, in well, maths and thing, that. You want to get up? Yeah, 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 yeah I was yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh, uh -huh, <laughs> bro. All right, yeah. Cool. So how was it after school? Um, I went college. I went mm. to um, I went to a good college actually, mm. Richmond. Oh, you switched it up then. Richmond upon mm. Thames. All right. That was because I, 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 I um, a, a girl that I was with at the time. Yeah. I won't say her name. We used to mm. hold hands and go mm, college. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, it was love. <laughs> she had been sprung. <laughs> Man's holding hands. Uh, the prettiest thing you get me. Yeah. Fresh. She looked like a shanty and that. Uh, 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 like uh. Richmond, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But Richmond College got divided because the Peckham youths and the Kennedy youths started beefing. Okay. So like. We was, was there for like in a year. The, mm. I got kicked out of that college because I went into class and the, the, the woman was like, you're stoned. I went to mm. Scott class, smash bro. <laughs> like man, we were smoking by the river. So yeah. I don't know, this was loud. This uh, was flavors uh, then. Uh, 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 you know, I came back flavors. in the class uh -huh. and she's like, you're stoned. I was like, I'm looking around me. The ginger juice there, the lights can you, you know when white boys get buzzing, they look smashed. Yeah, of course. I'm like, what the fuck, miss? <laughs> look at him. But <laughs> I don't care, I snitched. I snitched, I snitched that day. I was like, nah, look. But I'm going down he, everyone's yeah, he's come, what the fuck? Oh, he smashed out his face. He's like, you get that was it, left uh, that college. Uh, but it was the bare division in there anyway, because mm, like mm, the, I was cool with the Peckham youth, so yeah. But like the ends where I came from, there was beef in them. Mm -hmm. So it was a bit. Mad, yeah, yeah, but yeah, I was yeah, I was yeah. neutral because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I grew up with a lot of people from football where I knew yeah, a lot yeah. of pecking okay. mutes from. That's where I know a lot of pecking mutes from was from football. Okay. As a Brixton you, mm -hmm. and that's when Brixton and Peckham was beefing. Mm -hmm. I was cool because because of football. Yeah, okay, so you knew like I, I was yeah. uh, Bobby Kasanga I used to play with oh, okay, and couple okay. other people. Uh, you know what uh, I mean? Was uh, on my team. Yeah, that's how I'm cool in in, mm -hmm. in, in an arm. Okay, you know okay, I mean? okay, okay, saying that. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. All right, so moving forward from that, then, because um, I mean, personally, I know you from the Insta, mm. London Open TV, but before that, you had another Insta, right? Yeah, I had, um, um, it started off as Fire of Truth. Yeah, Fire of Truth. Yeah, Fire yeah. of Truth. Then so what, so what, what was there one before that? 
Um, yeah, start Fire of Truth. Yeah. It was yeah, knowledge. It was knowledge. It was knowledge, music, and bands. Okay, that was my okay. first Instagram page. Okay, okay. But because it was so long winded, <laughs> mm -mm. I thought I need to change this. Yeah. I need to change this. Then mm -hmm. I just changed it to Fire of Truth. Mm -hmm. Then Fire of Truth. I forgot what happened. Then lockdown happened just before lockdown. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And I thought, right, they're closing everything. Mm -hmm. I want to create a media outlet because yeah. I was heavy into protesting okay, yeah, and all yeah. that. I want to cover. That mm -hmm. side more because originally I created a platform because mm -hmm. I knew that was for my music because the type of okay, music I okay. do, conspiracy, mm -hmm. conscious, woke rap. Yeah, yeah, I knew yeah, these yeah. platforms weren't going to mm -hmm. support, man. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I yeah, want to yeah. create my own platform. Okay. Then I got lost in the source of creating my mm -hmm, platform. Mm -hmm, I forgot mm -hmm. the music. Yeah, yeah. You so know just what I mean? Started posting just different content. <laughs> yeah, or going to protests and yeah. like because London Open TV is journalism. That's mm -hmm. what it is yeah, that I'm yeah. trying to. Mm -hmm. bring to the forefront yeah that's what I see because I see you post it's not just one you post like yeah. various different subjects where it's all information and knowledge yeah mm -hmm. like it's alternative journalism yeah. guerrilla journalism mm -hmm. but it's weird trying to do journalism as a black brother yeah, yeah because say like if I um, do a, a post about you yeah. and it's criticising you mm -hmm. man then will come for me in an aggressive tone Mm -hmm. Or aggressive man, like, mm -hmm. why is my post? Bro, you're in the public. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. if BBC posts about you in a negative term, you're not. Are we talking about the people that you actually, if you post about someone that's in the social, that's on the, so, that's, that's that's social, on the social media, media and you have an opinion about them? Yeah, doing community work, mm -hmm. so whatever they're doing, they mm -hmm. take it personal. Okay. But these same man, I'll, be, I'll, see, I'll see them sit down with all these other BBC, ITV, mm -hmm. man mm -hmm. that you know has been racist and mm -hmm. got a mad background mm -hmm. ground mm -hmm. of paedophilia and all yeah, You yeah. still sit down with them and have, and have manners yeah. and come on their show in your best mm -hmm. interior mm -hmm. and be like, yes, yes, yeah. I speak all calm <laughs> to Pierce and them. I see man the other day sit down uh, with Nigel Farage. Mm. Um, what's his name? Farron Paul. I see yeah. him sit down with Nigel Farage. Mm. I'm like, what does Nigel Farage care about black on black crime? He doesn't. But I've, in... Um, Farron's um, defense won't it won't it um, bring more enlightenment to um, I don't I don't know the context to his of, calls yeah of course I don't know the context of what of the um, interview or whatever but won't it bring even though he is a mm. you get me he is he is not a maybe a, not a good character mm. wouldn't it still bring awareness in that Oof. I would disagree I would say yeah anything mm. can bring more awareness but mm. who are you bringing awareness to. People that already think we're, we're shit. Mm -hmm. People that already think mm -hmm. that our children are violent. Mm -hmm. That's who, And this is my thing. Yeah. It's the way he presents it. Like if he's there for black knife crime. Mm -hmm. Because when he was on Fer um, Nigel Farage's show, mm -hmm. the way it was presented, like he's stopping black on black crime, bruv. Yeah. When it's not black on black crime that he deals with more time. Okay, I don't know. No, but I'm saying I'm telling uh, you, he deals okay. with he deals with white brothers more time. There's nothing wrong with oh, that. That's, oh, yeah, of course, that's still a beautiful mm, thing. Mm, mm, mm. But I'm saying the way they present him, like like he's an advocate for black on black crime only, like, like he's the superhero for for black people mm, and mm, that. Mm, when mm, we mm, got mm. the biggest problem, but mm. it's not that mm. I've had argue. This is what the only reason I'm bringing this up. Yes, this is I, one of the issues that you've had basically. Because is, is this one that you, did you make a um. Did you make a uh, post on... No, I didn't do a post on, on that, him. but a okay, cool. um, couple of weeks before I commented on something mm. and this guy contacted me like that. Okay. Farron Poole going, Ro, what are you doing? Da, da, sending me bare shit. This is what I do. Da, 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 da. Trying to prove himself. Trying to, I'm like, why are you trying to prove yourself to me? Mm. I must have rattled your cage, mm -hmm, room, boy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, you get mm -hmm, me? Because mm -hmm. my thing's not coming from a place of heart. Mm. What did just, you, is it all right to ask? What, what did you say? What's the context? Um, yeah, it was. It, I won't go into it because oh, it was right, deep. Right, cool, yeah. Someone was accusing me on the side. Yeah. Some, some girl done some mad video. She was obviously had, but some of the context of what she's saying was true. Yeah, but a lot of it was lies. You say accusing, accusing. It was a mad post. I think the girl's a bit. I'm not too sure the ins and out, but I think she's yeah. a bit. But there was one or two things that she said that I said. Accusing, yeah. am I allowed to ask who or huh? is it the same person that we're talking about who she's accused? Uh, not uh, Farron Paul. Yeah, like she's she accused, accused him of bare madness, saying oh, yeah. your family's on madness okay, in the okay. ends, and yeah, yeah. rare, 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 you're advocating for knife crime, but your okay, people on this. Okay. Da, 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 da. Basically, he's, he's contradicting himself. Basically, yeah, it was a long-winded like, like, thing, yeah, yeah, but I didn't cool. agree with everything she's yeah, yeah, saying. Of course, of course, of course. But all I'm saying to him is like mm. things like, "Bro, tell us the truth. Black youth ain't coming to you, so mm. at least I can cover that and say, mm. you know what, brothers, you need to check um, Farron." If you're in a place of where you got a knife, you need to get rid of. Duh, yeah, duh, duh. Yeah, yeah. But if he's presenting it like it's already that, mm -hmm. then people are gonna think that people black youths are going to yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When he did say to me when I spoke to him, he was like, "They are coming to man a bit more, rare, rare." But 
Do you know what it is? I listen to what people say and I listen to their interviews because he, mm. he was on GMTV and he was like, yeah, seven out of 10 is white youths that give him knife. Okay. That's what he said. Okay. That was a couple of years ago. So mm. I brought that back up. Yeah. You know what I mean? But my point mm. is, forget all of that. He's yeah. doing great works. So yeah. I'm not taking away his great works, yeah, but I'm saying sitting down with Nigel Farage mm -hmm. is a joke thing. Mm -hmm. Come sit down with me, fam, but you're shook because I'll ask you the right questions. Mm. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. They won't, these men are shook to sit down with someone like me because I'm going to ask them the questions. Nigel mm -hmm. Farage don't know about the ends. Mm -mm 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 -mm. He don't know why these youths are going through what they, oh, what right. does Nigel let Farage me, know? Let me, can I ask you something? Mm. Question people might want to know, listening. What sort of questions might he be shook that you might answer? <laughs> Because <laughs> there might be someone in there saying, "He ain't gonna be shook. Why is he gonna be shook?" Da, 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 da. That's so, a good question. You flipped that on me, man. You put me on the spot. I'm saving that for when man sits down with man. I ain't giving oh, away that. You know that. You know that. I, I, I ain't giving that away I to other they, podcasters. And <laughs> now, next minute, I, I know there must be about <laughs> ten questions that you got for him, fam. No, but London. I'm saying. Oh, right. I'm saying if I give them questions, oh, right. he, what he, sort of questions that are you gonna ask them that's gonna make them hot in their seat? That's gonna make them that's hot gonna in their make, seat. Make them question the the or are you authentic, sure you want to get into authenticity this? of what they're doing. Because when <laughs> I'm looking at it, I'm and people from the outside looking at it, mm. they're looking at it as someone that's actually advocating and making moves. Mm. And this is why he's getting these opportunities because he's actually making moves in our sector, which they're saying that he's making moves in, which is well, you know I thought like it was black. I just well, I just thought it was knife crime, and I thought he was helping the black majority. But as you said, it's majority of white people. But it is he is still helping black knife. It's you, in general. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. I'm helping. I'm not, don't get it twisted. I'm not talking about just him. You yeah, know. Yeah, no, I know you're talking about generally. In generally, there's, there's I said people, people want to sit there's, down. There's a lot of people that advocate. And, I could use rappers mm. as an example, mm -hmm. like drillers. I, any yeah. driller that sat down with me, because I see them sit down with yeah. all these funny people that know yeah. nothing about drill, mm. know nothing about the ends. Mm. You're sitting down. I saw Digger D sit down with this Channel Four presenter. Yeah. She don't know nothing about the ends. Mm -hmm. She's asking questions about the violence. He's giving her a mundane answer, mm. like it is. This is my environment. Or, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, them stupid yeah, yeah, answers yeah, yeah. that you couldn't give, mm -hmm, man. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because Abdul, who yeah, grew course. up right next to you, is a doctor. Yeah, yeah, but I hear you. <laughs> so I, guess, I guess them people don't really care. You're a person that cares about the environment, mm -hmm. innit? Mm -hmm. So basically, they're going on platforms, as what you said with, uh, what's his name? Ferrer. Yeah, yeah. No, they're no, no, like I said, just to make it clear. They're going on platforms yeah. with people that don't really care about the community. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's, that's my that's, point. That's your point. That's what, so but I'm saying, is that not helping the cause or is that a bad thing? Is that, is, I don't know. I think here, yeah, what it is with me. Or, yeah. or they should be able to mix it up, go there, but then after go and have a conversation with you. Not just that, me, but I think. Or someone like you that's yeah. going to be like really about the community and really care, care, care. Yeah, because what I notice about people, when they get to a certain stage, they will only go on like ITV, BBC, but what it is now, you've got a platform now. Mm -hmm. So you coming on somewhere like my platform mm -hmm. or your platform yeah, is going to build Help our platforms yeah. and where grassroots, mm -hmm. where the community yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you it. going on Nigel Farage mm -hmm. and and I've seen man sit down with like people like Tommy Robinson. You'll sit mm -hmm. down with Tommy Robinson, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, but you won't mm -hmm. sit down with me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That, that That's just yeah, mind boggling yeah. to me. Yeah, or, or when I come at you in any sort of way, it's hostile, it's like, mm -hmm. like a fight kind of energy when mm -hmm. man's not getting in no fight over community issues with yeah, nobody. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, make yeah, that clear. It's like a, it's an aggy thing, but I think mm -hmm. it's a black and black thing. It's, mm -hmm. it's a self hate. Mm -hmm. It lies deep yeah, because yeah, yeah. to me, if you're if if you're going around on all these platforms, you should go around on the up and coming platforms as well, the yeah, community yeah, platforms. Because yeah, I don't see Nigel mm -hmm. Farage out there Reparations Day. I don't see mm -hmm. Nigel Farage out there for protect the children. Mm -hmm. I don't see Nigel Farage out there when they was telling us all to get the vaccine. You mm -hmm. understand? Mm -hmm. I, Nigel Farage went there. Mm -hmm. I was there. I didn't see Nigel Farage at Free Congo. Mm -hmm. I was there. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. So yeah, he don't yeah. care about our community. Mm -hmm. He's using them and as clout. Mm -hmm. You understand? I'm yeah. not. I don't even tell you truth. I, 
This I rather sit down with real people like mm. you. Yeah, I hear From you. I see man that's mm. just, just sniffing the mainstream all the time, mm. I'm gone. Mm. Just like the yeah, rappers, the whole yeah. rap thing is dead. Mm. Mm-hmm. Like sucking up to Americans. Mm-hmm. You don't know the ins and outs of America, really, mm-hmm. boy. Mm-hmm. America's cruddy. Just mm-hmm. like me, I know North London, yeah. even though I'm from South, but I don't know North London. Yeah. Yeah, and you. I'm from South, so mm-hmm. how can I be from South and saying I know the Bronx? Mm. Yeah, <laughs> or know what these mans yeah, are up yeah, to yeah, behind yeah, closed things? Let me shut up. No, no, it's no, no, it ain't nothing. So everything's coming out now anyway these days, so yeah, ain't got yeah. A, yeah, but I hear you. Mm-mm. I hear you. All right, cool. No, I hear you. So basically, um, um, I don't know if I got this right. A lot of the people, is it's what you're saying, is a lot of the people that's out here representing mm. the community, mm. they ain't really... It's a front. Is this what... Is ever, would I have ever got that wrong... Mm. Or, or, or once they once they once they're in the community and doing the community work and then they get a little love from the community, they break away from the community and don't want to look back on the community and only look at people like ITV and want to just do these things which mm. is for the limelight and not really for the cause. Because if it was for the cause, they would be they would be maybe going on ITV possibly because it's the views, but they still be doing the groundwork with the people that's on the come up. Is that would that be correct? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm not necessarily saying mm. that. Like, uh, I don't know, the Ferrans and all them type of people, it ain't coming from a good place. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm not saying that, but Mm. I think, like, say for instance, I'm going to have to say it, Idris Elba. Yeah. When we was in lockdown, Mm -hmm. he was pushing the wax on our people. I I actually see that him and his girlfriend. Well, we're lying that they had it, bro. Mm -hmm. And we're saying that black people need to take it. Mm -hmm. Then who do I see Ferran with? Idris Elba. Okay. And it just fell out become this knife crime campaign thing. Mm-hmm. I'm like, bro, where you been? Mm. Where you been? In oh, lock- yeah, they done a vid- did they do a video or something? They done a music yeah, video. Yeah, yeah, I think I see that. Yeah. Totally bollocks. Mm-hmm, they mm-hmm. done a music video, <laughs> knife crime awareness. But my thing is, I'll ask the people now, can mm. we trust someone with an MBE or OBE if you're an agent of the establishment already? You're mm-hmm. agent of the establishment once mm-hmm. you've got these things. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm not saying we can't, but I'm mm-hmm. asking the question, can we trust someone who is officially agent of the empire? Look up what OBE and MBE means. Mm-hmm. These men are agents of the empire. Anthony mm-hmm. Joshua's got one also. Um, thing, but not to say that they are. Mm-hmm. They might be good people, but mm-hmm. I'm asking, can we trust people that are officially mm-hmm. under the queen? The, so when um, it's time to really stand for the people... Mm. Are they going to be able to basically once? Because it's like they're not on the people side. No, because they're, they're, they're Cause as you just said about um, yeah. Idris. Yeah, he's not really on the people side in it. If he lied, mm. and you're saying he lied, yeah, about the um, vaccine. Yeah, obviously he's leading the people to the slaughter. No, exactly. And what this is what are people people got a um, short memory. Lockdown revealed a lot. Check all them community leaders. Check all these people. They wasn't there, bro. They wasn't warning the people, don't take this thing. They was hiding. They even said it. They were scared to lose their platforms. They mm. scared. They care more about their platforms mm-hmm. than the people. Yeah. My platform got taken that time mm-hmm. when Wiley was doing all that anti-Semitic. So he wasn't being, he weren't even being anti-Semitic. He's just telling. But when Wiley mm-hmm. was on all that smoke, mm-hmm. they took my platform that time as well. Oh, they, they took, took it? with me. This is my second Instagram. Okay. They took my platform too. What for- happened exactly on that occasion that made them um, take your um, platform? And this is probably why people are scared because they want to just. <laughs> they don't want to. No, you're platform. scared. <laughs> I'm, sc- I'm scared. <laughs> He's like, oh shit, man. I'm going to lose my platform. Listen, me. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't care, but I don't care about that. None of that shit. <laughs> I don't care about none of that shit. Everything that Wiley was saying was 100% true, if you ask me. You get me? Majority of black people can't be anti Semitic anyway, for the record. Yeah. yeah? yeah. I'm like okay, saying, okay, yeah? Okay. <laughs> for the record, yeah? <laughs> they can't manipulate that man with that, with that shit. But, um,. Yeah, exactly. What did you post that made them um, get your thing nah, taken down? No, them times there, I, I, bro, I was, hot. I was out there, man. I was out there them times mm. there promoting the don't take the vaccine thing mm, mm, with mm, all mm. the freedom fighters. Big up High yeah. Priest, big up mm. Ramiz, big mm. up Me Free, big up big Alan up, big Saunders, up. big up all them, man. Big, big up Freedom, big, big up Mr. Payne. Them man were out there. Big up Captain Rambo also. All like, the man was fighters. out, Bro, man was out there when they mm. were saying we can't talk about this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Man was out there when they're saying we could go to jail for this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You understand? These men were hiding. Yeah. These men, when it got a little safe, when did these people come back out? 
Mm. When Black Lives Matter came out, that's when you saw certain men started to rise their head. Yeah, they were yeah. shook before that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were shook. Mm -hmm. Like literally shivering in their boots. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't see them on Instagram and that. Mm -hmm. That's how scary it was. Mm -hmm. But me, I was just being guided by my gut. Yeah. Like God was just telling me, be out there because mm -hmm. they're doing something mad. Mm -hmm. When in history have they forced us to take all takes like, at the same time? This is the time when the community should have been out there mm -hmm. and on a on a on a mazza. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean, no, bro? 100%. Like, cause they said that we can't visit nanny. Mm, they said that yeah, we no. can't go to each other's house. We got to keep and and these people hid. This is mm. why I know certain men are plants mm. and being funded, bro. Mm -hmm. By the gov, like they, 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 some of them seem like yeah, they woke, mm. they this, they for the black community, but it's not that mm. behind the curtains. It's not that. <laughs> yeah, definitely, they should be standing up. Mm -hmm. Um. Would it be would it be um, right to say, if they're not speaking up, does it mean that they're working for the other for the other side, or they got a, another agenda, or possibly that just they're just scared, they're just shook, and they just what the, the little that they've built up, they don't mm. want to get taken. I I see. I, do you know what I am? I use Asha D as an example. That's the next a good, very good example. Mm. He got pressured. He looked like someone had the 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 the, the, the whack to his head when mm. he was promoting the vaccine. Mm. I don't remember if you remember that video when he's there, he's all sweating. He's saying, yeah, it's important that the black community take the wax. Because remember, this was mm. before Top Boy was going on to Netflix. Okay. So if he didn't do that, he, that he right. wouldn't have got that deal, my brother. Mm. Mm -hmm. So in, sometimes I have to really sit back and think, you know what? If I was in that situation, because you got to think, Ashley's built himself up yeah. to a place now mm -hmm. where a lot of people, sorry, a lot of people are relying on him mm -hmm. in his family. So now yeah. it's like, if I don't take that deal, my whole empire could crumble. Mm -hmm. So there is one bit of me that has a bit of mm -hmm. that. Yeah. But 80% of me is like, no, bun them. Because mm -hmm. this situation is going to happen again very soon. Yeah. And they're going to take that side of the fence again. Mm -hmm. They're going to keep on taking that side of the fence. Yeah. Imagine if all them celebrities and that, or those people with platforms like, no, nah, fuck that, I'm standing with the people. Yeah, 100%. It would, the people would have still had you afterwards. Mm -hmm. But now it's like, you can't talk on nothing. But, but they wouldn't have been getting, all, that's what they're worried about. They're worried about their roles and their presence in the social. And mm. I guess, I'm not sure, would it be right to say that the powers can be, that be kind of, do they control that? In a sense, in a sense, yeah. In a sense, yeah. You can be like for the people and all of that and off the mainstream, mm -hmm. but them lot are mainstream yeah. now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Once you're mainstream, is it possible to read? Is it possible to stand up for your people while you're mainstream? Because not to be funny, like, even mm -hmm. like if there's any like, um, any conspiracies that's on the internet, anything like, and it could be like Diddy, for instance. Diddy's happening now. Like <laughs> when you see like the posts, like on Instagram, and you see like the comments, you never see no blue ticks say, <laughs> saying anything, Nothing. anything about anything about that. Anyone talking about COVID or anything? None of the man that's with blue ticks that's got any influence say mm. all the comments is quiet. Mm. Is that is that so that's is that basically that's basically just a telltale sign of what's happening? Mm. Well. We gotta see it like then it's the people as well, isn't it? Because after all of that, the people still don't see that these people aren't standing up. So the people still supporting them after they saw blatantly that we was in an unprecedented, unprecedented, unprecedented situation that mm -hmm. we've never been in. Mm -hmm. You understand where they had us on house arrest, mm -hmm. and these people and the people you're still gonna get behind them, still watch their thing. So yeah, yeah. we still got a long way to go because mm -hmm. the people are still. Um, on this idol worship thing. Mm -hmm. That's that's the biggest problem. And and I think it's being revealed right now, back to mm -hmm. what you just said, back mm -hmm. to the Diddy thing and mm -hmm. that. All these men, that man used to idol worship, not mm -hmm. idol worship. Look, mm -hmm. when I was little, yeah, Bad Boy was a yeah, thing. Of course, everyone, not, everyone loved Bad Boy. Everyone loved Biggie. Everyone, <laughs> everyone listened, loved Biggie. Everyone listens to that. If yeah. you ask me Biggie or Pac, yeah, yeah, I used to say Biggie when mm -hmm. I was young, 14. Mm -hmm. When I got a bit older, mm -hmm. it was Pac, because yeah, yeah. I started to understand mm -hmm. Pac more. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the idol worship thing, I should I do worshiping things being like revealed now mm -hmm. that it's bullshit. Mm -hmm. Like my one that hurt 
that got to me the other day was Nas. When I yeah. saw Nas do a song with Little Nas, okay. X, yeah, yeah, that yeah, burnt yeah. me. Uh -huh. Cause I'm like, God's son wouldn't do that. Yo, mm -hmm. God's son, <laughs> you tell me class. You made me believe that I yeah, can. Yeah, yeah, like, you yeah, know the yeah, way yeah, that yeah, Nas yeah. made me believe in myself, bro. Uh, 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 and then yeah. had the, the, the Egyptian thing all on his thing mm -hmm. and all these, like all when I was that. young, that was yeah. a rapper I used to be, yeah, mm. not, he weren't my favorite rapper, yeah. but he was top six. He was up there, yeah. He was up there, you mm. get me? So. Yeah, that, that touched me when I saw mm -hmm. Nas push the agenda because mm -hmm. the agenda's closing now because Bobby Land's time's up. So mm -hmm. they're getting strict on these celebrities now. Yeah. You have to conform more. Mm -hmm. We mm -hmm. have to see you openly pushing agendas. Mm -hmm. Nas's thing, I posted it yesterday. Mm -hmm. Post was going mad because mm -hmm. a lot of people didn't... I see, that, I see that he took it down. He took I it down. Yeah, I took <laughs> it down. No, I took it down because I was like, you know what? You're promoting it. I'm promoting it. In a certain aspect. Mm, mm, mm. Even As though you're showing awareness, it's promotion at the same time. It's mean? promotion. Even though I only mm. showed Nas's mm, verse, mm, 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 mm. but little Nas was in there as well. Yeah, That's yeah. why I just done a caption after mm. like, raw. I'm just going to remember the 90s Nas. This Nas yeah, is, yeah, a, yeah, is a clone. Yeah. I don't mm. even know who this mm, Nas is. Mm, He's mm, gone. Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah, I mean? Because yeah, to me, you've, it, it's not a thing of even him doing a song with a gay person. Mm -hmm. It's a gay person who's pushing the agenda. Yeah, yeah. There's a How, yeah. big difference. Yeah, it's a big difference. Big, big difference. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Whining on the devil mm -hmm. and all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah, come on, too bro. Too much, yeah. You, too much mm -hmm. fake, um, going on like he's pregnant and all yeah, the, oh, yeah, disgusting. Yeah, yeah. And you got to think the kids, like, but even though not a lot of kids probably look to Nas now, that's mm -hmm. why we might be a bit safe because yeah, yeah, the kids don't yeah, 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 care about them yeah, yeah, like that. Like that. <laughs> but it hurt my so. child. My mm -hmm. inner child was hurt mm -hmm. by seeing Nas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. No, definitely. Yeah, definitely. You never would have thought that. 100%, 100%, sad, 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 sad. So, um, talking about the, um, we done with the COVID? Boy, bro. It is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. So like, what do you think about the COVID? You think it was real? See, see, you see, um, my take on it, which is a possibility. I kind of think that, um, you know, when they're talking about the 5G thing, I kind of think that was kind of real as well. So yeah. when they was talking about the 5G yeah. and when they was taking everyone to lockdown, I think they was turning on the 5G. Because if you look like into the rage, the symptoms of radiation, yeah. it's basically the same symptoms of COVID. You get me? Yeah, yeah. Because if you go and research the yeah. symptoms of COVID, nausea, feeling fever, da, 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 da. Yeah. So it could even just be, just be that and they locked in and then everyone's getting ill because your immune system's down now. Mm. You get me? Because everyone's been exposed to a next level of radiation. You get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because a lot of them signs is lungs and it affects your lungs and all that. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Every, like, yeah, I think that that was a case of like just us being told that we can't go out, we can't do this. Control. That could have got anxiety in us. Yeah, the, yeah, the yeah. That as well, fear. putting down the system. So yep. everyone's scared. 100%. Like, me and one of my brethren's as well, big up said that, like, we was out and about them times mm -hmm. there. Like, we was, out, <laughs> we was outside, bro. Like, you know what I mean? And all man saw outside. Mm. Do you know the weirdest thing? Mm. All man saw outside in South was mm. in the parks and stuff. Because mm. that was the, that was the banging place in mm. lockdown. Don't you remember first lockdown, February, it was boiling. It was mm -hmm. hot. Yep, yep, yep. From yep. February, mm -hmm. right through yep, the first yep, lockdown, yep. it was hot. I remember. Like, when you went to the parks, bro, it was all middle-class white people still in the parks, mm -hmm. jogging around, mm -hmm. living like normal. Mm -hmm. Why black people were just scared in their yeah. house. Masks, poor people, mm -hmm. not even black people. Mm -hmm. But, but when, I, when I, the richer people was out jogging, mm -hmm. they was living normal. Mm -hmm. I thought, they know something we don't. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? They they would be the scaredest usually if the government yeah, course, tells them something. Yeah. So they must have different information mm -hmm. from us. Mm -hmm. But I do believe... I don't know if it was real or not. No, mm -hmm. I do know it wasn't real. Sorry, mm -hmm. let me mm -hmm. rephrase that. Mm -hmm. It was real, mm -hmm. but people die of colds all the time. Yeah. People die. Of, so if someone did die of a cold, they will just glamorize it. Look, mm -hmm. look, look how much deaths you saw on the news every day. Do you really think that was real? Yeah, of course. 70,000 yeah, yeah, people yeah, yeah, died yeah. today. <laughs> 80,000 people yeah, died today. It was yeah, mad, yeah, bro. Yeah. And it's like, everyone's forgot. Mm -hmm. But I don't think it's people forgot. I think it's a trauma thing. Mm -hmm. People just want to forget. Yeah, they want like, that didn't happen. It didn't mm -hmm. happen. Because mm -hmm. if people did remember, we were, and look, everything's going up now. The government's mm. just buying us in our face. 100%. April, went in shopping the other day. Everything's gone up by like 50p, bruv. Mm, 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 you get me? Let's say I've done a 150 pound shopping or whatever. Mm. I was like, what's this? It's not adding up. Mm. It's not adding up. And you got to think, it's what they took from us. Remember yeah. in lockdown, you know, we was all on Amazon just buying random shit we yeah, didn't need. Real, Do you know how much shit I was buying in lockdown mm, just, to, just to keep the kids entertained, yeah, yeah, board games, real. this, yeah, that, yeah, this, yeah. that. 
Like we've always been mm. paying our taxes. We've always been paying our rent. Mm -hmm. So why is everything up so much? Where, where, where's the break? I thought last year was bad and they're still doing it this year. Yeah, I know. Insurance is going yeah. up, car insurance, mm, why? It's crazy, I know. Like, I'm, it's cause Trying of, to put the pressure on basically everyone. Squeeze us out squeeze of here, bro. But my mm. thing is, as not even as black people, mm. white people, black yeah, everyone people. Everyone is affected by this. What's really here for us now? Mm. Like on a real, you know what I mean? Like, mm. but as black, as me from London, I can only talk what I grew up around. Yeah. Black youths, it's like, we're in like a trap, like London's everything. The pound is everything. Mm -hmm. We can only make it here. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's the mentality. It's like, the mentality. Like, like mm -hmm. even me, I've been like, yeah, I want to get out of England, but mm -hmm. I'm going to wait till my peas is up. Mm -hmm. Wait till my peas is up. Because this, this pound is up there and there's yeah. the value of it. I hear you. But you're going to wait till yeah. When you see when your peas get up now, you're going to feel comfortable here. Mm -hmm. You're not even going to want to mm -hmm. go. Mm -hmm. Like my nan said to me, don't wait on the money to leave here. Because mm -hmm. wherever you go, you just want to be able to work and get your money. So you don't want to go there when you yeah, broke up yeah, now of course, yeah, of and you're old, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Just just go, you'll find mm -hmm. a way. Cause I think the Englishman, whether you're black, white, whatever, is worth more outside of England. Yeah, yeah, I believe that as well. You know what I mean? Yeah, just having that <laughs> mentality of growing up in mm. London, you, when you take it out, I think it, yeah. Yeah, even go I go to Portugal, cause I go to Portugal often, my nan lives there yeah. and Bro, they don't care about money like us over mm, there. Because mm, they, mm. do you know why they don't care about money? Because mm. they got life. Yeah, living. They're living. Yeah, the sun's there, that's tree there. And the proper tree, tree and thing, yeah, real yeah. one and that. <laughs> we're in, a, we're in a concrete jungle, you worry about money more. Yeah, yeah. and we're in this fast thing. Mm, mm, Even yeah, if you fast. go outside London. Yeah, it's not as bad. When I go see my brother, it's like, mm, bro, mm, it's mm. slow <laughs> around here. Well, well, I can hear a pin drop. In the night, it's pitch dark. Uh, yeah. I can see every star. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean, bro? Yeah. Like, it's just the- It's your time to, my time, my time to rest. Mm, mm. Mm, you mm. don't have that here. It's just always constantly, yeah. you got to get money. You got to get money. You got to yeah. get money, 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 money. Bear, peer pressure, peer mm, pressure, mm, peer mm, pressure. Mm, 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 That's why now I just step back, man. I see everyone chasing it. Then mm. I see a lot of people, what is it? Um, Say people their own businesses and like, yeah. doing good, it's all good mm. and that. But then when I look in their eyes, they look lonely as fuck. Mm, 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 mm. That's true. <laughs> and mm -hmm. see what is this is why in the West so much people commit suicide mm -hmm. and all these things, especially men, because mm -hmm. they go hard, they're going ham for this piece, but they forget about love, they yeah, forget yeah. about their family. Yeah. So when they do have a blip, it's mm. a big blip because mm -hmm. you're coming down from here now. You had a blip yeah. now. That, whoo, mm -hmm. Now all them people you locked off because you know how all these um, inspiration quotes say, yeah. stay away from these people. <laughs> stay away yeah, from your yeah. family. Now mm -hmm. when you drop off your family, you're like, what's up? You, yeah, you, you went, stayed away. <laughs> you stayed away. You was making videos about how, yes, I'm free from this. I don't need stressful uh, uh, man around uh, uh, me. I don't uh, need uh, 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 But they're the people that actually love you mm -hmm. even though you, you might not like them fully mm -hmm. or they, mm -hmm. sometimes they might be a bit negative. Yeah, they actually ways. love you. Mm. They actually love you. Then yeah. you go around people that just care about you in your best self mm -hmm. when you're on your smoke. Mm -hmm. You understand mm -hmm. when you're making money, yeah, of course yeah, they're gonna yeah. have love for you. Yeah, but course. see when they see you have a blip, mm, are they there? Yeah. You're gonna come back to you're gonna come back around your, your yeah. family that mm. you was cussing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's, that's, when the, a, that's who's gonna be there for that's you. That's who's gonna be there, yeah, bro. Yeah, 100%, yeah. Yeah, hundred percent. Real talk. Real talk. It's just like when my certain man go jail. Mm. They think that all the other their bridges are there is that for uh, there for them. <laughs> then they go jail. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Only the only phone in mummy. <laughs> it's mummy. Mummy's there for you. And may and maybe your siblings. Yeah. yeah maybe yeah, your siblings 100%. might send you a little yeah. 20 pounds, 50 pounds here yeah, and there. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? But yeah. <laughs> no, 100 percent 100 percent 100 percent But yeah. So um, but one thing I will say though is what you were saying earlier that is true is like about the criticism is like we can't have criticism on like no one in it. Just, just, else you're a hater. <laughs> you're a hater. Why are you bringing down a black man? But if the black man isn't standing in the position and doing what a black man should do yeah. in the position that, he, that he's in, who's to call him out? What, no one's going to call him out? <laughs> so it's, it's crazy, no? I'll say especially the UK. Mm. Especially the UK. Yeah, I don't know if it's, is it because it's because of the size of the UK? Because it's so small? I don't know. You're so accessible. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And what is as well, yeah, like, say I've done a comment about Thingy the other day. Uh, what's his name? Young Tef. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Do you know him? The I rapper. The rapper. Yeah, I don't yeah, know Yeah, I've done a comment about him, yeah. Because yeah. he, 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 he was putting up posts about, I'll take on any UK rapper and all of this stuff mm, there. Buzz. And yeah. all of this stuff. Mm. That I f what did I say to him? Oh, I feel like getting a comment up, you know. What did mm. I say? But basically, I got in a, 
Yeah. Uh, back and back to back forth, and forth with him. him yeah. yeah, I was basically in the comment sick, section. In the comment section. Yeah. But his energy, like, who are you? You don't know, man. Mm. Rare, rare, rare. I've mm. been doing this for time. Mm-mm. I was like, bro, you want to talk to no v- Vlad TV like that? So why can't mm. I have my Mm-mm. comment? Mm-mm. You're just a little blogger. And mm. who was that guy? Scraps. That rapper Scraps. Yeah, yeah, your scraps. ends. Bobby, your mm. brethren. No, he no, said, no. <laughs> scraps, is north. I'm north. scraps is more northwest. You get me? Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, that, they bloggers should get punched in their face. Oh yeah, I see that. I, I, I see. I see that comment on Shade Room or something. I was like, for what, bro? You're talking about selling drugs in our community and shooting people and stuff. Mm. Wh- who are you mm. to say that mm. to me? Like, why can't man have an opinion yeah, about you if you're in the public eye? Yeah, I, yeah, definitely. Hundred percent. I agree with you. Hundred percent. Depends. I guess. I guess if he's if he's talking about bloggers should get punched. Punching, punching the eye. I think that's personally. I think that's bullshit, isn't it? Unless the bloggers like really getting at you and telling you suck your mama. Yeah, yeah, that's da, 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 da. yeah, yeah. Unless it's something like that. Yeah. But if it's just constructive criticism and opinions, yeah, that's that's just a joke, and that just goes back to what I was saying. Like mm. <laughs> anyone giving them an opinion, opinion on someone that like, you seems a hater. So even more than seem like a, more than a hater, they're telling you you should get punched up. You should get punched up. It's some vicious thing. Like even I've criticized certain people as well that you mm. say certain people do community work. Basically, we're saying this. Basically, the people that's out there doing the work, you can't have a constructive, um, constructive conversation with them. You can't because they get defensive, especially as a black man with a voice mm-hmm. in the community. Mm-hmm. Like me, I I started my page. I wasn't even thinking people was gonna listen to me, mm-hmm. bro, or nothing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? So mm-hmm. when, now people's listening to me. They know, bro. If you said something, people might actually listen. Mm. Now I hear you because I see your thing is that. Come like you don't care. You're just saying it because you, <laughs> you mm. want to say it and get your message out yeah. there. Whoever hears it, hears it. But you ain't none no out there trying to do anything to get like, be liked or anything like that mm. to get out there. You're just doing you in it. That's why, yeah, that's, that's why I rate your thing. You get me? And that's that was my only problem with the brother. My problem with the brother, I, I thought you gave too much ratings to like these rappers and stuff when you stand for way more than them, Who's my that brother. Rass? Yeah, okay. you stand for way more than them. So what you trying, oh, wait, so just give me... Um, so what are you trying to say that um, if you're doing community work in the community, maybe for advocate for whatever you're advocating, yeah. say if you're advocate for knife crime mm. or just kids gang gangs gang culture, just trying to put put a stop to it. What are you saying that you can't be you can't be chilling around the man that's rapping about rapping about um, drilling the man? Bro, is that what happens? I could saying? give you a perfect incident, yeah, oh. but I'm not. Even, I'm gonna. I'm gonna drop it in the next way. Yeah. Say you see someone on a thing now, community worker, yeah. standing there with a rapper, yeah. yeah, that talked about something crazy, like putting your one of your boys or family in a spliff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I see you standing with him. Mm. I'm thinking, what? Yeah, of course. This is mad. What? Yeah, of course. The, the rapper that you're standing with. Mm-hmm. Is promoting every in mm-hmm. our community. Mm-hmm. It don't make it. Don't, what, I just see standing man, on the picture, what big, big in the No, big him man up, big like this guy, big like this. Yeah, like yeah, I yeah. see man stand, like say like um, OFB. Is that them? You, they are see man. St- yeah. I, I read like I see them man standing with them type of people, mm. and I'm like, it's not that you can't stand with them. You got to stand with them on your grounds yeah, yeah, where you're sticking on mm-hmm. them, not mm-hmm. you. Like big up my man. Yeah, that's what, I was, that's what I was thinking. If you're standing with them, it's one thing to be standing with them, just bigging it up, bigging them up, but it'd be. The next thing to use what you stand for with them, innit? So I don't know. Yeah. Maybe a conversation or something like, yo, like, we'll maybe make them open their mind or something rather than just a picture because I yeah. don't understand. Because I think, I think what it is with a lot of people as well, because um, I see, like, Bobby Kasanga does that a lot because mm. he does, like, the football leagues yeah, okay, yeah, with rappers that. and yeah, stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, he says, Bobby's um, saying is there's method in the madness. Okay. You understand? So okay. it's, it's to get the okay. use looking at his page. Mm-hmm. So I kind of understand okay, well, the perspective, okay. mm-hmm. but I think mm-hmm. when you do that, I think children see through lukewarmness more mm-hmm. than we mm-hmm. think. Mm-hmm. They know when you're lukewarm mm-hmm. and they play that against you. Mm-hmm. Oh, you know the struggle I'm from. Mm-hmm. And re- so they'll make you're making every excuse for them to be bad. Mm-hmm. Also, you're rolling with my man. Yeah. Oh, um, I don't know. I don't know, Killer123 yeah, yeah, or yeah, whatever his name yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So mm. you respect him. Mm. How do you respect him? Yeah. But I respect you as a youth worker. Yeah, but you respect yeah. this guy who I respect what fuckers. you're doing in the community as a youth worker. And then you're, big, you're the person I are looking up to. Yeah. Because it's like they're looking up to them, correct? Yeah, the way they big, big up my Achilles, big up this, that. That's the only mm. thing that I'm... Re- that's my biggest thing with community work because... 
You can't be lukewarm in this thing mm. when it comes to the, like you can't like even I could go into something else as well. Mm. <laughs> let's go bust there. It, bust it. Let's go there. <laughs> like let's go into religion now. All right. The so Christian right. and the Muslim thing. Mm. All right. Like Muslims now, the Muslim brothers ha- like in the rap thing, it's a big thing now. Mm. A lot of these men go um drillers and that will say they're Muslim. Yeah, yeah. A lot of men. Mm-hmm. But my thing is now about it, it's like man forgets. The, the root mm-hmm. that we're black mm-hmm. and and we're at war. Mm-hmm. Like people forget that. Mm-hmm. People be on this, yo, Maaki, like to mm-hmm. uh, each and every other race. But mm-hmm. when it comes to black people now, it's not that same. You don't have that same fight. And what I'm going into now is, is Pan Africanism, mm-hmm. Marcus Garvey. Mm-hmm. Marcus Garvey was Christian, mm-hmm. but he stood for black people first. Mm-hmm. 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 Africans for Africans. Mm-hmm. We can't forget that. Because mm-hmm. then when shit hit the fam, yeah, any of these black brothers who are Muslim or Christian, get touched by police, who's on the battlefield first for them? Yeah, not the church, not the mosque, yeah, it's the real. black woman. Yeah, That's who real. will be there first. For Any real. protests I go to about black man being shot, it's the black woman, it's not the church or the mosque, it's the black woman yeah, there first. For real, I'm, so, I'm, I'm sure that a couple of these jitters or these jewel artists and that must have been Muslim and that. That's been murked. Yeah, lot. And Chris Carver was. I went to the Chris Carver protest. I went to the Chris Carver protest as yeah, well. Yeah, I, 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 I didn't see the Muslim man out there. He was Muslim. But I didn't see the Muslim, the Muslim congregation out there. Is that's what I, I'm I saying? I never knew he was Muslim till just now. Where was the mosque? Mm. Where's the mosque in knife crime? I'm not saying they might be somewhere, but I'm just. Okay, yeah, where's the yeah. church? Mm. Where, I'm, I'm calling out. But where's the mosque and the church? What we've got to understand is these are businesses. Mm-hmm. They're not house of God. Mm-hmm. The house of God is within. Mm-hmm. I don't care what religion you are. I don't care what mm-hmm. you start. That's just buildings. Without people in the mosque, without people in the church, there is no mosque. Mm-hmm. There is no church. If there's no one in there. 100%. It's just a building. Mm-hmm. So how can it be a place of God? 100%. It's not a place of God if people ain't there. You know what I mean, bro? Yeah, yeah, so, so all I'm saying is do your religion thing. I don't care what religion mm. no one is, but don't mm. forget who we are and mm. what we are. Because mm-hmm. like Marcus Garvey said, a people without their root don't would not know their future, bro. If you don't know where you're coming from, mm-hmm. how are we going to go somewhere? Mm-hmm. You know? And I just think there's some mad thing going on now where we're putting everything before, before this. Mm-hmm. Like I heard Bouncer say he gets more love from Asians than the black community and all this stuff. That was mm-hmm. embarrassing. Yeah, My brother, how could you say yeah. that? The why only reason I know you mm-hmm. is because you promote the demise of our people. Mm-hmm. The only reason I know you is For because real. you promote drill music. Mm-hmm. So how mm-hmm. could you say black people never done nothing yeah. when you made money off the blood of our people? That's what busts you. Mm. That's what busts you. Mm. I'm not, I don't know what's going on behind the scenes, mm, but for mm, what mm. I know, mm. dig, dig that mm. is black. 100%. Little man is black. Mm-hmm. You understand? Yeah, yeah, so yeah, I, yeah. I know you from p- mm. pushing black people. Mm. Not, mm-hmm. I've never seen you with an Asian driller. Yeah, for real. Never seen you push an Asian <laughs> driller. Yeah, so that statement mm. about before I'm black, I'm Muslim is totally mind boggling, mm. my brother. Definitely. I'm not saying you shouldn't be proud to be Muslim. Obviously God comes first, mm. but we have a fight as a people mm-hmm. and, and it's systematic and all these other races, they stay together. They might be Muslim. The Indian man might be Muslim, mm-hmm. but he's Indian. Yeah, you yeah. know he's yeah, been Indian. Yeah. He represents mm-hmm. Indians mm-hmm. to a full mm-hmm. and you shouldn't say them type of things in public anyway. No, definitely not. Why you, would you say that? He was like basically discarding black people mm, saying yeah. my Asian... Why would you say that publicly? Why would you need to come up publicly and say that it's crazy yeah bro but like i said um i just think sometimes in england like people are just don't want to have open conversations and we're Mm. supposed to come from a place where everyone says keep it real Mm -hmm. keep it real then when you keep it real it's a problem it's a problem Mm -hmm. then you want then you then you want to shut man down Mm -hmm. because you want to keep it fake Mm -hmm. you understand you want to keep everyone who's commenting on you this is why i think uk rap is dead Mm because these men go to booth to studio with yes man Mm -hmm. because they respect their status the man Mm -hmm. respect yeah that's a banging tune fam (laughs) It's shit as fuck. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because it's dead. Like, yeah. it's, that's why certain man, when they get to a certain level, their music starts to die down. Because there's Cause, too many yes, man. People don't want to lose the connection that they've got with them. Yeah. So, so that, yeah, that tune's banging, yeah. even though you think it's shit. Mm. <laughs> and it comes back to what you were saying, that we were saying already, if anybody giving criticism is seen as a hater. Yeah. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, do you know what? Like, I'm gonna I'm gonna declare on this podcast. I'm done commenting with anything English anymore. If it's rat community yeah. stuff, yeah, my comment's gonna be PC. No, I've, I've Say just nothing after this after this podcast. After this podcast, right, I'm cool, just letting it out. This podcast ain't done yet. 
<laughs> so we're gonna get it all out. <laughs> get it all out, man. It's the truth. It's the truth. It's truth podcast, man. We, go, we gotta get all out. All right, cool. Moving on now. All right, we're gonna go into current affairs. Right now, there's a lot of um, full gazy stuff going out on in America with the industry, the music industry. <laughs> Diddy. There's a lot of man that's getting their fame. That's up at the top. Yeah. That's staying relevant because they're participating in mm. in stuff. Um, Behind the closed doors, some man are getting bent over the table. You get me for their for their deals. Life for the table. Man. <laughs> 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 All right, I've I've been hearing this for ages. I ain't gonna lie, I've been hearing for like fifteen years that Diddy was gay. You know them ones there, like so. This is nothing new, but it's it's only funny now. It's because. Certain people's like, you're trying in shit, it's conspiracy theory, it's conspiracy. Yeah. Yeah. They've been saying that for years, so now it's actually out in the public. It's like, okay, we can actually talk about it. This is actually real. So you just being naive and <laughs> that you might have been in the bubble. It's just like yeah. the same people that believe in that believe COVID was you get me true. It's yeah. just that kind of that same bubble, in it, of mm. mentality. So um now that we know this is going on in America, the man are doing that. Is it happening out here? Well, is I- it happening out here with our <laughs> artists? That's at the top and they're staying relevant. All right, let's just deal with, let's just deal them... with the top one that I've seen people been pushing the most mm. that I disagree with, gigs. I'll yeah. say it straight. I don't I don't know yeah. personally, mm. but I think Diddy latched onto these man because he knew his empire was falling. Yeah. And so that's why he attached to gigs. Remember, gigs mm. weren't allowed in America yeah, yeah. for how long? So mm-hmm. now he's allowed in America. Mm-hmm. He's like, Rock can check Diddy. Mm-hmm. He's not, remember, like I said earlier, if I'm from... Brixton, and I don't know about North London. If mm-hmm. Giggs is from Peckham, you might mm-hmm. know about Queens or mm-hmm. America, but you don't know it internally. Mm-hmm. So he's going in there like blind, mm-hmm. really. You mm-hmm. understand? Yeah, so yeah, yeah. all this, because he's in a couple pictures with my man and that, he's this mm-hmm. and that. Mm-hmm. I, I don't think the UK industry has gone that far to be fruity, mm-hmm. but it's going there with mm-hmm. Central C because mm-hmm. Central C is prepared to do fruity shit. Let mm-hmm. me tell you yeah. why. Because yeah. he's all got right. a tune with J. Cole. Yeah, he's got a tune. He's, okay. he's getting busted with it. everyone in America. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much UK black boys have have put in works and have been more relevant than Central C on a level of like a part of the culture? Yeah, black like, man. F- bare Central ta- C's not fairly new, isn't he? He's fairly new, but he's allowed to cut tune. Why? Mm-hmm. Because that's the face they want for UK rap. Yeah, yeah. Hey, they yeah. want the white youth to mm-hmm. be the face of UK rap. Mm-hmm. All the bloodshed mm-hmm. that 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 our youth went through. All the all the lives that are lost. Twenty seven jewel artists are in jail right now, my brother. Mm-hmm. Twenty seven. To me, where he is, mm-hmm. he took Digger D or Lowski's place mm-hmm. or Dig that. Yeah, he yeah, took. Quite, it should have been one of them, mm-hmm. man, because they're way better mm-hmm. rappers yeah, than him. Definitely. Yeah. They'll spin him any day mm-hmm. of the week. Mm-hmm. You get me? But yeah, yeah. he took their place. Why? Because he could travel to America. Mm-hmm. They couldn't because they was mm-hmm. actually living in the battlefield. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, real. how comes everyone's on gigs and we know gigs ain't a vulnerable you, a mm. vulnerable man, mm. but Central C was spending Happy New Year's with Diddy. Mm. Diddy party and that, he looks vulnerable to me. Mm-hmm. He used to, he was the one that looked, I call him Central Lesbian. He was the one that had a nose piercing and looked like a mm-hmm. yell couple mm-hmm. le- years ago. Mm-hmm. I'll be more... I think gigs can handle itself around them, man. They're central seat. I'll be like, yo, bro, watch yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, you get me? Yeah, but everyone's yeah, yeah. on gigs mm, trying mm, to destroy him because yeah. he's the face of UK rap in America. Mm. So they're trying to bring him down mm-hmm. and replace it with central seat. But ain't they just trying to bring him down because he's just made of, uh, he's got a strong link with Diddy. And he's been recently with Diddy a lot. He went to America with Diddy. Diddy come out, out here and done a party yeah. with Diddy. I thought that I thought that was the reason. I never thought it was because he's at the top. I just thought because at this time, yeah. unfortunately, <laughs> yeah. Diddy's um, probably has been, I mean, Giggs has been with Diddy. So I remember I see him on the beach with Diddy in whatever, when he's talking that like, slang, whatever, teaching him the UK slang. And yeah. That. Okay. <sighs> then if we're going to do it like that, yeah, we got to deal with everyone that's 100%. been around him like that. I just think... He ain't been around him. That, mm-hmm. Like his mm-hmm. his relationship with him ain't that strong or mm-hmm. that or that. Mm-hmm. See, everything just sounds like a wild <laughs> conversation. <laughs> that strong or that long. Yeah. I'm like, uh, <laughs> but anyway, uh, <laughs> fucking no. Yeah. But yeah, I'm, I just think with that one there, mm. Mm, I just think people are just 
just dropping stuff for the for yeah. the banter. No, it's just banter. You. You, you know what I mean? Yeah, but I overall, I would I'm... say to UK rappers, stay away from mainstream rappers in America at the moment. Mm -hmm. Their thing's crumbling, mm -hmm. bruv. Mm -hmm. all, go back and listen to all the conspiracy theories from 10 years ago and mm -hmm. see how it lines up. 100%. See how it lines up. Go mm -hmm. listen to some old school conspiracy rappers. Go listen to Dead Prez. Go mm -hmm. listen to Dead Man yeah, there, yeah, bruv. Yeah, they was yeah, telling yeah. man about these things from... from DMX back. told us. Yeah. DMX way told back. us these men are bending over mm -hmm. from Mm, mm, and mm, everyone mm. saying DMX was mad. Mm. He was telling you about Jay Z and Diddy from time. Yep, he said yep. those niggas take it, man. They take the D, mm, man. Mm, mm, they take the D, mm, man. He's been saying. I it. saw a clip of that yesterday. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. how I'm seeing mm, it. Mm, you know mm. what I mean? Like, there's been people that's been done tell us about mm. these man. But I think with the UK and America. I'm, I think the UK is in a place where America's trying to form some Illuminati, mm -hmm. like kind of safeguard thing mm -hmm, over mm -hmm, here mm -hmm. where only certain people can bust. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, That's definitely going mm -hmm, on to a certain mm -hmm. degree. I, th I think, yeah, I think some UK man are part of it. Yeah, 100%. That's why like when they have the brunch and that certain man, certain man will go to the brunch yeah. out, out in the UK. Personally. What brunch? Whose brunch? Who is it? The Rock Nation brunch or whatever? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. Rap, 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 rap man signed to Rockefeller, innit? Okay. He signed to Rockefeller. Mm -hmm, He's got mm -hmm. a thing coming on Netflix. Okay, okay, okay. Under Rockefeller. Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know, man. If I was in the industry, if I was. What about, what about um, Skepta then? Because I see you post a Skepta oh. on your. <laughs> I see you post a Skepta on your um, page with the, um, the girl women's blouse. I know, me personally, I don't think he, he wore that out of his own. I think he was told to wear that, innit? Okay. What do you think? You think he personally went to the shop and went to the women's section, bought the women's blouse and thought, for enemy, for the for when I win this award, which he probably knew he was going to mm. win, I'm going to wear this women's top. I'll be honest. No. Because, yeah, because Jamaicans and Nigerians, I'm not even Jamaican, I'm going into something mm. mad, but let me deal with Jamaica because that's where I'm from. Mm. Like, dancehall, there's a very, like, some man just very feminine in that mm. domains. Mm -hmm. Like all these tight jeans and thing mm. were old school in the yard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And some little mm. freely tap on. Mm, 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 you know mm, the way mm, they're mm, like, mm, mm. but wearing a dress, yeah, but that top that Skepta had on, it was suspect, but it's more what he said. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I don't mind wearing girls' clothes. Like, be specific. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> he said, he, did, he was specific. He said mm -hmm. certain patterns. I just think he's a guy that's into fashion. Mm -hmm. Some of us like ni cl nice mm -hmm. clothes, mm -hmm. but we're not into fashion. Mm -hmm. When you're into fashion, mm -hmm. you're into next shit. But one mm -hmm. thing I don't understand about these rappers. You know why I said that? Because I think that same top couple other man had this exactly the same top on it, innit? Mm. I think um, Lucy, little Uzi Vert or something had that same top. Similar to, I mean, now you're yeah. saying that. I, I, <laughs> so I'm like, okay, okay, this is a top that they're giving their members. Oh, <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> you yeah, get maybe, me? I, think, I can't remember, I think Machine Gun, I can't remember, someone else. No, nah, maybe he's the, he, he, the, the Skeptar. Yeah, he's and, definitely and pushing the and, and I did see that when he went to America, he did go to America as well on bus over there, mm. shut down. Exactly. And when, and when he went over there, he was taking fruity pictures. Yeah, with yeah. Playboy, there's Playboy Carti. Yeah, some fruity pictures of Playboy Carti where they're hugging each other in the pink and that. Ah, so I was yeah, like, Skepta's Skepta sus. He's been suspect for a little while still. He's, I can't, I can't back them man. There, you know what I mean. But because obviously I, yeah, he's from North as well, isn't it? So it all seems. But do you know what is a Skepta? Yeah, he just seems like an artist. Mm -hmm. And artists are different people. Mm -hmm. They don't give a fuck of what no one thinks. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. why you got to take that into consideration mm -hmm. that it might not be fruity. Mm -hmm. He might just be an artistic genius. Because mm -hmm. when it comes to music, mm -hmm. he's a genius. Mm -hmm. I rate him more than most because he mm -hmm. makes proper songs. No, he does. He does. Proper bangers. He does. You know what I mean? He makes mm -hmm. proper, they, they seem constructed the right mm -hmm. way. Mm -hmm. So when it comes to Skepta, you have to take it he he he's like an artistic genius, a Picasso mm -hmm. in this in this shit. You get me, guys? So he might do something that me and you would never think of doing, mm -hmm. class, hey, hey, or hey, wear hey. something me and you would never. Because in his mind, it's just art. Uh, 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 you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and he yeah, don't yeah. have to walk through ends like me and you no know more. He's in the Rolls Royce. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So he, it's different. Mm, 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 mm. Hundreds, hundreds. All right, cool. So you think it's not happening out here as much then, basically? Mm. There's no one. There's no one that you think of in the music industry that's a part of it. Then, no, they are, man. They are, man. Because we've named a couple, and then you've been like, no, no, no. I didn't say no. Oh yeah, it's not. It's, oh yeah, you're just saying you don't yeah. reckon. No, the fruity thing with Diddy and that, I, I don't. I, yeah, you said gigs. Yeah, you don't think gigs. Mm, because me, the, I don't think. Me personally, do I think gigs? Um, I can't vouch. Me personally, man. I would say my purse. 
I think that Diddy, being who Diddy was, mm. um, with all the information come out and all the um, stories I've heard about Diddy, like he's the guy that likes to walk around naked, mm. like just in the room, and don't matter if Mandem's there or not. Mm. Um, I think that personally, I think he could have tried it with Giggs. <laughs> 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 not to say that Giggs had it, I think Giggs would have said, shut it down. Now yeah. anyone can try it with you. Yeah, yeah. So, no, that's someone can try it with me. That's get me like, shit. Who, am I? who you are. What, did he think I'm anyone to Diddy? I'm a yeah. rapper, UK rapper. You think I'm Diddy's respect to me in any way? Yeah, Diddy's yeah. been around for fuck yeah, ass, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. I stuck it on them and got his way with yeah, them. Not so, Mick Mill. For, for, <laughs> so for him to not try it with me. Yeah, no, real talk. Real. It's for me to shut him down and put him like, nah, this is what it is, isn't it? You get me? Mm. But for him, I, I can't, I, I'm, I've, if that's what he does, he does it, why would he not try it with me? Who am I? Yeah. Yeah, who, yeah, you, who am I to, day, for him to not try it with? I can't vouch for no so one, big? bro. Yeah, that's <laughs> I what I'm but so I, whether he, I don't think Giggs done it, I can never say never because I don't know Giggs personally. But personally, hopefully never. But I don't. But I, per, I think personally he did. He tried it. Oh, well, like, you have to remember. Oh, you you're have, saying you don't? I get what you're I saying. I think he would. He would have tried, tried, tried it. Wanted to try sliding the 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 hint, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Whether to see the levels because mm. that's what he does, isn't it? He likes man, and he's. You could, mm. That's your thing. If your whole thing is you bring man into the industry and you do your thing. And yeah, yeah. So no, like, yeah, yeah. I don't think there's no one that's too big for no, Diddy to, shit. to try. Real shit. Me? Yeah, try, but to try for, yeah. for us yeah, to say no, that yeah, he, yeah. he no, succeeded. I can, never, I can never say that he succeeded. Why for that? Yeah, why for that? Man succeeded. That word done out here enough, man. <laughs> he achieved. Achieved. Yeah. <laughs> but I could never say that he, he wouldn't have tried. He's got too much ego you yeah, get me? he's yeah. too big out there he yeah. feels himself too much to not try there's no no for real for real no one could put it apart mm, I, I can't yeah mm. but like my main thing is i don't I, the reason why i don't fit no uk rapper is really mm. bust in america because if they go to these parties these uk rappers how we are over here mm. and they got bare match yo what's going what the fuck's going mm, on in here fam mm, yeah, i'm cutting yo yeah. did the i'm gone fam yeah, <laughs> we're a bit more screenish even when they have wait, a hold on but yeah, we are a bit more what is it but if the information that was in the um documents there was that, that the, was fake documents oh is it fake stuff? i oh, think like, them cool. ones were but fake from what information i heard even from people saying it in it mm. Sometimes the, I heard that the drinks are spiked anyway. So if you go to the party and drink one drink, boy. Yeah, that's a peak thing still. If you get spiked, you get spiked, innit? In the morning, it's, a new, it's the next day. <laughs> oh, no, man. <laughs> Anyone can get spiked, chicks get spiked all the time. You get me in the morning, they wake up and they don't know what's going on. Gone down, you get me? Do you know what makes me question these men? Not even whoever. I'm just saying in general, rappers, is mm. when they sit down at these fashion shows, yeah, that's to me as well. That's weird, no? Yeah, bro. And you got a man walking down a fashion show in a phone or something, and you're just sitting there like, mm. I don't get it. I don't get that either. And obviously, you've been paid to go there, mm. but I, I got morals that like, I'm mm. not gonna sit there if man's walking down with a brownie's head mm. and thongs on, bro. Yeah. And you're just and horns coming out mm. his head. You know how they do them yeah. freaky things, yeah. and you're just sitting there supporting this. Mm. But if I say, "Raw, right, here's my clothing brand. Come support it, cuz. Come mm. support it, cuz." Mm. It's a problem. It's a problem. But you go support these men that are directly... Yeah. What is Versace? So mm. Versace is a is a fish. Mm, okay. He's yeah, a fish. Course, yeah, Most of them brands Most are them fish are, people, yeah, but you, you support them full uh, heartedly. And, and on, the, on, the, on, the, on the runway as well, it's got man in dresses. <laughs> like, what are you there for? It shows that mm. you so that, that, that you're, you're saying you're mm, on that side of the mm, fence. Mm. Because you're not supporting your own people like that. Mm. You wear all these big brands. When Imagine now if we had one trainer Mm. In the UK that we're pushing from our thing, we're all mm. wearing it and all pushing it. It's gonna become the biggest thing. 100%. Then we can afford to have our mm. own fashion mm. shows mm. to pay you to come. But mm. it's like this generation don't wanna take that sacrifice of mm. you know what? We gotta lock off all these brands and make it all in-house. Mm. Because we are the trend, 100%. we are the hype, mm. we are the flavor, mm. we are the seasoning. Mm. You know what I mean, definitely. bro? They forget that yeah. money ain't and nothing. We allow them to use us for the money. Money. Mm. We they use us for the money because mm -hmm. they, they give us no they give us money because they money, give us money and use our influence yeah because money mm. means nothing mm. our influence is mm. more yeah. money's just a piece of paper yeah. Yeah. like to give them a couple hundred thousand mm. you know mm. what I mean? definitely yeah so you say man them are selling out for the money is that what it is it is and 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 I think that um this is where I'm going to the Christian and Muslim thing again mm -hmm. and yeah it's like bro 
if you're Muslim or you're Christian, is what you're pushing, is it right by the contents of your book? Mm-hmm. Your book. This ain't me talking. Yeah. By your book. By your, what you say you believe in. What you say, what you're doing for Ramadan, what you're doing for Christmas, what you're doing for Easter, if you're Christian, would you say what you're pushing and you're promoting is right by your book, by what you say you stand on? Because there's no lukewarm. You can't be good and bad. What is it? What, is it good or bad? You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. What are you in, representing? in the middle, you're saying? Yeah. Or is what is hip hop? This is the next question. I'll ask you. Yeah. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Of course, come on. <laughs> what has hip hop done for the black community in the last 30 years? 30 rap? years? Yeah. Or in general, you just up to, to up to this time now, what has rap really done for us? Um, it's given the exposure to our, I was going to say it's exposure to our culture, but it's, I guess it's a bit one-sided culture. Um, I think in the, in the last 30 years, what's the, what year are we in now? 2024. So that's going back to 94, is it? Yeah, 96, 94, something like that. Yeah. Um, really it's just been it's been you from that time I think it was kind of been used to promote um gang the gang culture mm. since NWA mm. and from that it was a bit of a balance but I think as time has gone by yeah. to now the balance has just gone gone tilted 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 yeah. till now it's just true 100% and there's one like five percent is conscious, conscious rap with, mm. with a meaning and spiritual, like a soulful, yeah. soul, soulful music. That's what I personally think. So, yeah. um, but it's it's gave some people money, but the people that has give money, it seems like our puppets that's playing by the ball. So they ain't really using none of their money for nothing really constructive mm. in the community. That's what I would say. So, um, I don't, I, um, I don't really know positive. You get me? Mm. It's given us the aim of aim of um, positivity and because certain members are fr- individuals are flourishing from it but yeah. the, what they're pushing isn't really good yeah I agree on that that point there I see what you're saying because say like um, even though they're all going to be exposed well Jay-Z Dr. J mm. they made us start thinking about billions yeah, yeah, we was thinking about millions mm, 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 in, in 99 mm, and that mm, no mm. one was saying the word billion yeah, yeah, weren't yeah, even yeah. in our vocabulary so yeah, in the they, black they, community yeah, they, 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 they did give us hope for like looking at looking at the lifestyle wasn't it mm, mm. Aspiring to that. Yeah, yeah. Aspiring to that. The, yeah. Your means is whatever your means is, you get me? But I guess they gave us they gave they gave us that vision and hope that you can that you can make it mm. yeah. musically and that. Yeah, I, I, what would you say? What yeah, you? I agree with what you say um that, that point especially. Mm. But I'll say like as a whole, it's been used against us. One hundred percent. It's been used for the demise of our communities, mm. it's been used to um stop black love. You know mm-hmm, what I mean? 100%. It's been used to push that we see black women as bitches and mm-hmm. we don't see them as beautiful. It's yeah, been yeah. it's been used mm. for the kids to hate the parents and the Definitely. olders, mm-hmm. especially the younger and older gap. The mm-hmm. reason why the youngers don't respect the older is because the record label will be giving you 25 grand for one single. Mm-hmm. I could just about give you 50 pounds. Mm-hmm, so it's like my respect is going to him mm-hmm. because he's giving me more yeah, money. Yeah, 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 you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. So it's just like, yeah, it makes us um, rap. Hasn't contributed nothing. I use UK rap. I use UK rap as a perfect example. Mm-hmm. Right now, I said it already. Mm-hmm. Twenty-seven drill artists are in jail at the moment. Mm-hmm. I was burning out drill from two thousand and eleven. Mm-hmm. As soon as I heard that shit, I was like, "This is the devil's music," mm-hmm. and it's evidential. It's not mm-hmm. a rumor. It's not a this. It's not a mm-hmm. that. It's. I saw it in the paper the other day. Twenty-seven man in mm-hmm. jail from one genre of music. Mad. And look how small the UK is. Mm-hmm. And it's all black youths. Not, not forgetting the amount, amount of man that's died. <laughs> I didn't even want to bring that, that side as well. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Um, I've lost someone very close to me. Mm-hmm. Cousin and that, I won't even say. Yeah, yeah. I'll rest in peace, little cousin. You get mm-hmm. me? Like, mm-hmm. And that was bef- I was burning out before that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So yeah, when I lost cousin, bruv, mm-hmm. yeah, it's just like. Mm, what can you do? Like it still don't feel real with that, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Because mm-hmm. the way, it's, yeah, I don't even want to talk about that mm-hmm. at the moment, you know what I mean? Yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah, the whole drill thing, it was a setup. Like mm-hmm. I, I always say to people, we went from trap to drill. We went from mm-hmm. gangster rap, which mm-hmm. meant, and you said it perfectly as well. We had a time when it was kind of balanced because mm-hmm. there was. Be- did, mm-hmm. did you? How old? How old you around? Forty. Okay, you're my age. So you remember that time when everyone was wearing like the black medallion with the African mm-hmm, on it, yeah, yeah, Afro. Yeah, 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 there yeah. was, it was fifth. You had Lauren Hills, but you mm-hmm. had little Kim. Mm-hmm. 
You understand? Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Yeah, that's it. There was a balance. That's what I'm saying. Back in the day, there was a balance. As you said, Dead Prez, you mentioned the Dead, Dead Prez was, and they was doing their, they was in re, in the record shops, you get me? Exactly. And they were big. <laughs> they, they was in the record shops next to the Jay-Z and that. There was a trace. There was but a now, trace. Mm -mm. And look at the little girls. Girls is the perfect example. Mm -hmm. Where I, I'm going to say it again. Where's the R&B groups, girl yeah, groups? Yeah, definitely. Where's the feminine black mm -hmm. women? They're all like on some bad boy thing. Mm -hmm. Around man. Like, yeah, I'm like, bro, yo. Mm -hmm. Like every they're girl. They're all bringing masculine energy in it, isn't it? They're all jacks from Top Boy. All mm -hmm. of them want to be a little jacks. You get me, bro? <laughs> I'm like, what's going on here? This is mad. All of them talking about skanks and that. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, it's sick, it's, it's proper horrible. Like seeing is, that, because I was watching, because I've been taking, because I'm not going to lie, I've been staying away from the black mainstream culture like the last two weeks. Mm -hmm. I've been I've been looking in Indian culture, okay, okay. Japanese, mm -hmm. see their girl groups, mm -hmm. feminine, bro. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, their little mm -hmm. girls on some proper like mm -hmm. woman thing. Yep, yep, it's not yep, like yep. strong Chinese mm -hmm, woman, bro. Mm -hmm, <laughs> you mm -hmm, get mm -hmm, me how's, <laughs> how, it's meant, how it's meant to be. It's how it's meant to be. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? I'm not saying you can't, there's always gonna yeah, be. There's always gonna be a balance, but there's balances. <laughs> oh. Like we had tomboys when we was younger, yeah, of course. But as soon as a girl shows a sign of that, now we call them a lesbian. A lesbian straight yeah. away when yeah. she could have just been I know, exploring being a back boy in, for a back sec. Back in our day, yeah, there was girls, girls that was tomboy, tomboys like till late, like till <laughs> eighteen and that. And Tom you can't be a tomboy till eighteen now. You're written off as yeah. a lesbian. Or she starts. You know what? Yeah. Is, they're in school and they're a tomboy. Then mm. they get to like eighteen. Mm. They start getting mad hips and, mm -hmm, and yeah, back that's now. It, man, yeah. like, mm, oh, the girl's kicking ball, bro. She's looking <laughs> mad now. You know what's tomboy? I see from back <laughs> day. They're all married. Hundred mm, percent. All them tom yeah. girls are married now. Yeah, man, yeah, they found yeah, out yeah. that no, when you backed yeah. off them clothes, yeah. she had a Mazza. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Yeah, that's it. But <laughs> now, yeah, no, you can't be a tomboy right now. Everyone's, everyone's like. Yeah, it's sad. Yeah, you're straight lesbian if you're yeah. a tomboy. Yeah. No, I think that's sad to label them them things from young. It's sad because anyway. I think the same girls that you're talking about that are married now, if it was in this day and age, they would have turned out lesbian mm. with the influence. You get me? Yeah. They wouldn't have got to, to that stage to marry and <laughs> made that transition because of the amount of influence just from every, everywhere, you get me? Yeah. Pressuring them, you get me? And yeah. then people assuming who they are because because mm. they're a tomboy for so long and tell yeah. you, it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I think. All oh, right, cool. Um, another thing I see, um, you have some little, there's some little, um, you had something with someone online about MDOT or something. Oh. We like to talk about that one. I, 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 you I touched it a little bit. I saw, I saw, a glimpse of that. What you, what you, what you say? What you say? You're not feeling. You're not feeling. M. M. Dot. Um, <sighs> M. Dot R. Do it, M. Dot R. Doing the doing the Jamaican things. The white man. The white man. It's not. It's tech. not really. What, a... you, what, you, how, how, what you say? What, what, what's how you feel about it? What's what's what is it? What are you saying? It's what's not really point? a thing of like. It's not a white or black thing right, really when it? it comes to M. Dot. It's All more right. like. Am I idiot? <laughs> <laughs> you know, people can say you're a hate or whatever, but I'm like, bruv. Cause I, yeah, it's just certain things I'm like, mm. do you know what though? I'll be real with you. Mm, that song, um, Thunder Pussy Red. Mm. Yeah, if a black youth done that song, they'll say mm. it's vulgar, mm. it's X-rated. Mm. Why do you think Styler G comes with songs like, Butty Big Like Dumpling? Mm -mm -mm. Pussy nice. get Dumpling. Mm -mm. Clean. Mm -mm. Not, run the pussy, I told the pussy. Red. Mm -mm. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's mm -mm. vulgar. Yeah, he, vulgar. He got run off stage in Jamaica for that recently. Yeah, okay. They ran him off stage and said, what mm. type of nastiness y'all deal mm -mm. with you? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What do you mean beat out the pussy until it's red? Mm -mm. You want to bleed it up? Mm -mm. What's going on here? Mm -mm. It's disgusting. Mm -mm. That's my Andrew. thing with the tune. Yeah, the tune is actually vulgar. Mm, mm, and mm. disgusting but people they just let him get away with it because he looks like a idiot mm. if, I, if, if I'm telling so you that, I don't know because I think some people when they look at it they see him as an artist that, but sometimes I think people look at it as a bit spoofy what do you mean like it's like a bit of a pranky yes like, like, it's not when, serious uh, yeah you know mm. that um, what's his name? So that like, it's a laughing and then it's like you get me. It's yeah, like in between. Is like, it serious yeah, or not? Yeah, yeah. Ma Ma Michael Dapper, mm -hmm. biggest UK rapper. Mm -hmm. Man's not hot. Mm -hmm. The biggest mm -hmm. UK yeah, rap yeah, tune. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the biggest. Man's not hot. He yeah, changed the way you speak, yeah. bro. I, I, I started to touch the road after that, like, <laughs> and and youths are talking like Michael Dapper, bro. Uh, He's the biggest UK yeah, rapper yeah, 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 yeah. you ever seen. hundred oh, <laughs> percent. Yeah, man from America is one. Like, yo, I heard that track from the UK. Yeah. <laughs> 
is not hot. <laughs> And they never, they're not even too sure if it, that is a joke. They thought it's real. Yes. They still think that's real. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, so, um, oh yeah, so basically you're just saying that on M.R. that mm. you don't rate, you don't rate, you don't rate his team because he gets away with certain things as a white man doing Jamaican that black man as a, black man as a Jamaican wouldn't be able to get away with. Is that, is that, is that, you know, has he done cool something that just, that's, yeah, that's it. He was on um, RTM. He's on RTM. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, and he was like to earn creams. When are the last time you been Jamaica? When are the last time you been Jamaica? <laughs> like, who are you talking to, bro? I got <sighs> dons I know who ain't been Jamaica that are Jamaican that will slap in your face for that. 100%. Huh? Yeah, you don't yeah, know yeah. the reason why man ain't been Jamaica. Mm, mm, man mm, might not been Jamaica because of some family mm, well, or mm, mm, man might have some domestics in Jamaica yeah, where man will get kidnapped. Yeah, yeah, for course. you to come say that yeah. as a guy with your white privilege mm, to come to, mm, to, to a black queen mm, and get all that I red think face. That you're actually more Jamaica. <laughs> what? And now he's doing this. I don't even want to talk about what I saw yesterday, but all the po- like he's saying he's got the biggest thing in the world now, bro. Yeah. He's, he's claiming Jamaica. Yeah, we know it's just, Man, it's, forget. It's, he's, this but, is, um, you let him go too far. You, it's you lot's fault. You lot let him get away with it. This is why he's gone mad. It's a publicity stunt, no? He, no he's not, he just can't really, yeah, as we told, said, some people take it as a joke in it, so I true. guess... He's, 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 he's playing using, the game. He's, he's using that as yeah. well. Yeah, he's playing the game. He's playing mm. the game. I, I don't blame. I think what he's trying to do is try to make the most money as possible because mm. he knows that it could be like um, a quick thing. But he yeah, could he could maximize mm, of this mm, 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 to to make his rest of a life the rest mm. of his life comfortable. Mm. From that part, I don't want to burn out his thing too much because yeah. he's a father. Yeah, yeah. Of course, you get me. Yeah, like, yeah. I want him to make money yeah, in that. Yeah. But M dot yeah. use your white privilege. As 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 a reggae artist, a dancehall artist, to talk about reparations in Jamaica, talk mm. about them things. Use your platform to talk about the betterment of Jamaica, not just run the pussy red and foolishness. Mm. You talk about, oh yeah, you're showing people cook food. People are already cooking food on the internet, Jamaican food. We know that by saying with your music, my brother, use that to represent something with Jamaica. I want to see you at Reparations Day on the first of uh, first of August in Brixton. You understand? Come there. Come because you're saying you're representing mm, yeah, Jamaica. For real, yeah. Represent Jamaica on that front. Mm. You know what I mean? As a white brother. Because we've got a lot of alliances. Look at White Yardy. He was born there, but White Yardy, that's a Jamaican mm, man. Mm, you don't mm, even need to mm, think mm, twice. Mm, In my yard, man. Mm, mm, you know mm, what I mean? So it's yeah. nothing to do with mm, mm, the colour mm, thing. It's more mm, the energy mm, thing. Yeah, and yeah. is his heart pure. You know what I mean? That's all it is with me. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't feel the, the purity from mm-hmm. him. Yep, Maybe yep. I might be wrong because mm-hmm. I know people that's met him and they're like, no, nah, he's a workaholic. Mm-hmm, he's mm-hmm. just working all day. Da, 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 yeah, da, da. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I could be wrong. Mm-hmm. Anything I say here, I could be wrong. You're yeah. entitled to say I'm wrong. That's what mm-hmm. people don't understand. Is that I could be wrong. <laughs> you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> all right, cool. Another subject that I want to touch on because we're kind of getting towards the end. You get me, but... Mm. Another subject I think we need to touch on is um, I see you like um, post a little uh, quite a bit about with um, Afua Afua Rose. Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So yeah. what's what's your what's your what's your what's your what's your what's your stance what's your stance on Afua and the madness? So I always see you posting about it. So I was no, oh. I post I post she's, I posted about a couple times on yeah, my page. Like, yeah. a, like, a couple times. Yeah, I see you. Yeah, yeah, yeah a couple times. Um, my because stance- there's some like there's a little love hate. With her, but I see what she's doing in the community, and yeah. from the outtake is that what she's doing is positive. Mm. She's just trying to help people that's mm. that's been suf- suffered from abuse. A- abuse. But obviously, because some of some of the abuse is not is not child and convicted, people are saying, "Who is she to point mm. out, etc." Mm. I think. What's your, so just for, what's your stance? I think um, as someone that goes to been around a lot of like community movements, people mm. protesting, da, da, all of this stuff. What she's standing for, mm. um, I ain't seen no man come out for, to yeah, stand yeah, up for, for uh, the, the women mm, being mm, abused mm, in our mm, community. Mm, a lot mm. of people scream, I'm here for auntie. But mm. when I when I went to a protest, mm. Afia's protest, mm. I forgot when it was, bruv, there was like 70 women there mm. that all have been through trauma. Mm, mm. And none of these men who say that they're here to protect the community was there. Mm. Even if, and me, see the thing I like, what Afia stands for, I think we all stand for. Yeah, definitely. You don't know women mm. to be sexually abused in our community. Yeah, and whoever does that should be brought to the forefront. Mm-hmm. But I think what she's took on, mm-hmm. even the police can't even handle it. Yeah, It's a hard thing to tackle with mm-hmm. her limited resources. Mm-hmm. She's going to make mistakes. Definitely. And I understand why some people are vexed with her. Because mm-hmm. if you call out a man 
for an hour or mm-hmm. something along them lines and mm-hmm. it wasn't him, mm-hmm. you could destroy his whole life. Even yeah. if it comes out, it weren't him. Yeah, so I definitely understand why people be mad with her. Mm-hmm. And there's definitely stuff to learn from what she's took. But to me, she was the first one to take the risk because mm-hmm. everyone was scared to make their mistakes. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's not that... I don't know about her individual cases. Mm-hmm. I'm not vouching for every case, yeah, if yeah, it's yeah, wrong yeah, or right. Yeah, 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 but I'm saying what she, what she stands for as a whole. Because yeah, yeah. I've been getting sick. A couple of people have been on to me because I because mm. I posted the rare, rare, rare. I'm like, mm. they're like your friend, your this, that. Like mm. I'm sitting down breaking bread, bread mm. with this woman. You yeah, understand? You say they're calling your friend because, but you post everyone. <laughs> exactly. It's, people pick and choose. But yeah. I'm not saying I, I, mm. I've got love for what the woman mm. does. Yeah. I've been on the front line with, bet, mm-hmm. with her a couple of times. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. But I'm, what I'm saying is I can't vouch for every individual yeah, case. Course, I'm not there with her. Yeah. I've never been to a house with paperwork mm-hmm. talking about people's case yeah, yeah, and yeah, all of yeah. this. But I'm saying what she stands for overall. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think you. you all don't want look your little sisters or, mm. or, or daughters to be abused. Mm-hmm. And I think that made Brixton, because it was more Brixton that she was, yeah, it was kind around. Of it, it made people mm. on their tiptoes. Mm. You know what I mean? But I think what is now, what we've got to understand with the whole past trauma of what people done back in the day, like 30 years, it's a mazza. Mm. Because them times there, it was a totally different yeah, of world, mm-hmm. bro. It was a totally mm-hmm. different world. Mm-hmm. A lot of our grandparents have like 15 years apart and that, mm-hmm. 10 years apart, normal. Yeah, in the, you know what I mean? Mm. So now when you, <laughs> but there's certain mm. elements of it that, that should be brought to, if, if yeah. they're, they're mm. persistent offenders and there's evidence of them, mm-hmm. they've got mm-hmm. children, Mm. And maybe they should bring um, bring to justice. I ain't mm. got a problem with mm. that. Yeah, but it's there a should very, be some accountability. There should be some account, but it's mm. a very tricky subject because mm-hmm. she ain't calling up like some people. These community people, they they pick and choose what they step for. Mm-hmm. Bro, she stepped for one Anyone. of the. She stepped for the one that was putting her straight in the firing line. Mm-hmm. Like this, mm-hmm. this weren't no. This weren't no playground shit mm, 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 that you mm. could just go to two kids and say, boom, boom, stop fighting, it's yeah, over. Yeah, da, 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 da. This is grown people mm, with trauma. Mm, mm. Yeah, 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 so yeah. she's probably made mistakes. Mm, mm, mm. She made big, she probably made big mistakes mm. as well. Yeah, definitely. But I rate her for taking that stance. Mm. That's that's it. Mm. I don't know about individual case, what your uncle done, what he done, what they done. Not your uncle, I'm talking people yeah, with the camera. Yeah, of course. Well, oh, you know what mm, I mean? What yeah. anyone done, I don't know individual cases. I'm saying what she stands for as a whole. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. What's hard to understand about that? You know yeah, what I yeah, mean, bro? On, yeah, it's mad, it's mad. So mm. we got what she does and if she makes any mistakes, that's her. I'm not a part of her organization mm-hmm. or nothing, mm-hmm. but mm-hmm. she asked me for support and I think it's something that I would yeah, want to support a, yeah, her. Definitely. The, the I would support. Big up, big up. Just yeah, like man. any of you, if you came yeah, to me and something was to, mm. to do the community and you wanted man support, Mm. I will support, yeah, for, course, especially kind of... if it's for the children and the women. Mm, mm, mm. Maybe you men I don't care about, but for the children, mm. and... <laughs> now I'm joking, mm. obviously, but for the women yeah. and the children, yeah, it's, yeah, it's speaking. we've got to stand for them. No one else is standing for them. 100%. You know what I mean? And yeah. so many women in our community have been through, m- bro, mm. madnesses. Whole, it's, and mm. the numbers are crazy. Yeah. The num- sometimes yeah, I think girls true. are lying. I'm like, well, you, you, mm. you've been odd as well. Mm. You've been odd. No, 100%, 100% it's even me, both girls that I meet. Uh, and you're like, is it me? Am I attracted to mm. this? <laughs> 100%. <laughs> it's not a laughing matter, but yeah, I'm just it's saying. It's not a laughing matter, but I've actually thought that, like, bro, like, I'm like, my healer, so I'm getting all <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting all these girls yeah. with damaged trauma like from the, from the past. Yeah, it's, it's weird. But, yeah, so but I think it's it was like, just that, it was happening that much. It's that much, bro. And it's, mm. it's not just the black community as well. You know what I mean? But I think it's more at the forefront in our community because in other communities, it's different. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like the Asian mm-hmm. community has a lot of, yeah, I met Asian a lot of Asian they girls. Own, they got their own issues, 100%. It's a mazza. Mm-hmm. But if you talk about it online, they'll be like, don't talk about us like that. They're very... Mm-hmm. Like they don't talk about their things in public okay, like us. Okay, okay, okay. Us now, we'll bring it to the mm-hmm. forefront. Then like, mm-hmm. don't talk about that online. Mm-hmm. Fuck that. Just it's forget about matter, it. Yeah. Make money. Mm-hmm. Get along with your life. Yeah, that's yeah, what it yeah, feels yeah, like. Yeah, or this yeah. doppy man. That's mm-hmm. what. It, that's yeah, their type well. of attitude. Yeah, 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 yeah. But us, we will podcast it. Yeah. We'll sit here. Yeah, we'll talk reason, about it, discuss it, trying to bring some, some yeah, some reasoning which will bring some enlightenment, which may which may help us. But I don't know if it ever goes like that. Mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> we talk, you get me? We do a lot of talking, but yeah, I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, but yeah, all right. Moving forward, so um, moving forward, 
given your um, experience dealing with black people, social media, how people are, um, how we how we talk, how how we react with we, with each other as black people or just as people in general. Um, what, what how do you, what do you, how do you see the um, future moving forward or are us of overcoming some of um, the tribulations that we have to go through, which is kind of um, holding us back. Um, is there is there can you see a solution in all of this or is it too complicated i'm saying mm. when we come together mm. this is when the world will unite mm -hmm. but because they've got the black man so scattered when we organize when the black man gets his place or black black man and black woman they're, made, that's, they're, they're making sure the black man never gets their place that's why they're putting all this stuff in but what i'll say to white people asian people that's going mm. through suppression that when we mm. get our place the whole world will be more in an equal place. This is why it's so out of sync. Because that's, that's what you would say to the white man and Asian man. Is that what you just said? Yeah. So what you're saying, they should help man get our place. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that um, don't be scared of black man uniting. Because okay. anytime, don't be scared of black man united. Because mm. every time yeah, I talk about black people stuff on my page, mm. White people will come on my page. It's not about, yeah. uh, it's about um, yeah. us all together. It's not about that's, that's what I said. That's what I said. Oh, da, 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 da. I was like, ah. Oh. But Depends. I hate that shit because every other race has their domination of people 100%. that are fully just for their race. And mm. there's nothing wrong with that. Mm. That's a beautiful thing. Yeah, I'm not even saying like, fuck other races. Mm. I'm saying like what the Black Panther Party said is white power for white people, brown power for brown people, black power for black people, yellow power for yellow people. Mm. If we all got our powers, mm -hmm. now we can come together, yeah, come together as the people and make Definitely. our powers combined. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Definitely. Like, like, Power Rangers and that, bro. Yeah, no, you know what I mean? yeah, 100%. <laughs> it's like, what's, like, what's his name was trying to do in it? You, is it Yui? Um, UP Newton. Yeah, UP yeah. Newton was trying to do. He's trying to, yeah, he's getting everyone. Because everyone's really got a common cause against the establishment anyway. Anyway. You get me? That's And that's it's the separation that they use and all the different, yeah, all the different ways that they can separate us. Which That's keeps, the realest shit, mm. what you just said there. Because I've been to so many, I don't just go to black things, black mm -hmm. protests. I've been to so many other little mm -hmm. protests mm -hmm. and stuff. And a lot of people, I've been on the front line, white people, black mm. people. But one thing I all do notice is, hold on, we're all going against the same per same thing here. Yep, yep, yep. So why don't we all come out at the same time? Definitely. It don't make no sense. Mm. You know what I mean? Even yep. like, even like the so-called, like say some people don't say they're racist. Mm -hmm. Say like, Let's use Tommy, for instance. He's yeah. Like, I've been on the front line with white people like that in mm -hmm. the time of don't take the wax. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. You I understand? Yep, yep, yep. Like, I'm looking next mm -hmm. to me. I'm like, this guy could be a racist mm -hmm. really boy. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. he's he's ready for mm -hmm. this fight. Yep. But we're or, on this or, fight together. Yeah. Or save the children protests. Mm -hmm. Bear white man, mad mm -hmm. tattoos. And, mm -hmm. Like, on a normal day. Yeah, but yeah, they're yeah, like, yeah, 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 for the children. Yeah, of course. No, no, yes. nonsense. Come right yeah. here. So we're joining together now. Yeah, yeah come on. Yeah. Yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Sometimes that, like, if that's what I'm saying. Black people that I even don't get along with, I know certain time I'm going to be on the front line with them. Yeah, come on. You understand? Yeah, it's that's how, if, it's bigger for the than cause. News. It's bigger than us. So mm. when I'm speaking and I'm pointing out certain stuff, it's not even about you, brethren. Don't take it personal. Don't take it. It's about the bigger cause. Mm -hmm. You understand? It's mm -hmm. about the bigger cause of things. Because mm -hmm. we give our power to white, uh, I hate saying white, but I'm using white media. We give too much power to them, bruv. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. And we don't, we don't empower ourselves. Mm -hmm. And um, we're seeing it back to the American thing. We always idolize these men. Now, you, remember, them men have always been run by them men in the background. You're seeing it for what it really is now. Mm -hmm. It's bullshit, bro. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That is, and this year ain't even, bro. Ain't even just you're gonna started. See yeah. the, you're gonna see Jay Z's thing, then Beyonce's mm -hmm. thing collapse. Mm -hmm. You're gonna see bear madness this year, mm -hmm. bro. You're gonna, mm -hmm. you're gonna be like, this is wild, bro. Mm -hmm. Like it ain't even started. Mm -hmm. Ain't. Ain't even started. Um, April the eighth, you are gonna see some mad shit in America. Remember, mm. I told you. <laughs> so, so, and that's basically um, April eighth. What's that? Four days away. So, and that's basically that's why we and that's basically part of the reason why we can't come together because of our influential figures that's in position can't be for us. Hello, <laughs> one hundred Lee. They can't. They can't. They can seem like they're for us. Mm. They can. But, so act, I got you. Act like they're for us, but act like they're for us. I'll give you a perfect example again. Footballers. We mm. say there's no rappers, entertainers. For Look real. how much we got yeah, them. That's supposed to be millionaires yeah, and all this shit. The most. Why? We say there's no youth clubs. 
Mm. Why can't they come to the ends and build a youth club? Raheem mm. Sterling, he's mm. Jamaican. Mm. What has he built in Jamaica? Mm. I don't know. I don't know. He might have built I stuff. I'm, I'm asking the question. I don't know, I don't but know. I'm saying, right, let's do the English yeah. footballers. Mm -hmm. Marcus Rashford, why is he feeding every racist man's kid? Why not just black kids? Mm -hmm. He mm -hmm. comes from the smallest island in the Caribbean. Mm -hmm. Is it St. Kitts? He comes okay. from the... Look after your people. Yeah, what are you course. feeding all these people mm -hmm. over here that are on benefits, mm -hmm. right, boy? Yeah, course, it's because he's not allowed sense. to. Mm -hmm. He's not allowed to help his people. Mm -hmm. He's not allowed to help his ends. Mm -hmm. Look how much money their basketballers earn in America. Yeah, yeah, I know. Stupid money. Imagine that the basketballers and footballers are like, you know, we're going to concentrate on one place in Africa, build that up, mm -hmm. and then we move on to the next mm -hmm. place in Africa, mm -hmm. build that up. Mm -hmm. It'll be light work, but they're not allowed to because they're controlled. It may, it like, mm. come on, the basketballers alone, that's mm. stupid. Yeah, footballers, 250,000 a week. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Telling me mm -hmm. they can't all put like a 50,000 a week yeah, into Ghana mm -hmm. for two years. Mm -hmm. What will that do for Ghana? Yeah, of course. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's, it, it's obviously that they're controlled, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? They're controlled to an extent. They can't do what they fully want to do. Even some people mm -hmm. that I know that's in the game or whatever. Yeah. yeah they. I don't see them promoting none of their people's shit. Mm. They promote like Stormzy done black excellence video. Mm. They said it was a black man was wearing Parada in it. Mm. How is that black excellence? Man yeah. was wearing Parada, who has been directly mm. racist about mm -hmm. her. Why did he wear Parada? Because Parada gave him money. Mm. So that means you'll sell out for money. I'm not saying Basically. him, but I'm using yeah, that as an example. Yeah, example yeah. And he's, Parada's been directly mm. racist to mm -hmm. us, but you, you will still fuck with Parada. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Money. Yeah. Like all these brands. This is this what basically starts with us stopping with people that don't really fuck with us. Mm. But mm. <clears throat> don't have our people, best interests. People love money more than us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you have a price? <laughs> Do I have a price? <laughs> <laughs> No prize, I can't be bought for no prize. <laughs> My G. Diddy comes now, says to you, Diddy comes, that's what's this mad? Diddy comes, you know. Diddy come with you. <laughs> so, hey, the game's messed. I spray messed up the game with all that wise shit, bruv. It's annoying. It even gets me now. It's like, but you know, it's a good thing, you know, this mm. white thing, because it's making mm. man think about what they say. 100% it's good to you, especially in the days of times now, because the way they're trying to push push it is why. Yeah, the young girls <laughs> makes you think why? Mad little <laughs> fruity words and that. Yeah, that now they have to think about mm, what they're saying. Yeah. So it's actually a good thing. That's no, why man's like, did he come here? Like, what's going on here? Mm. But if did he propose to you, I will buy your podcast and run it for you. Like, boom, is it is a mill. Dumb. But you have to come to America and live at my house for six months. Missus is on you as well. Missus has seen the check as well. It's like, this will change our life, baby. <laughs> it's just six months, ride it for the family. It's <laughs> six months living. I can't do it. You could. I, I can say it's... I can say that I'll go over <laughs> there and try to be on my best player and make sure nothing happens. Duh, 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 duh. So yeah. You can't never say that. Yeah, There's yeah. gonna be one time when you're not expecting it, Slipping. when you're all cool, then you're just gonna get that thing in the drink. Or and even then a just spliff. Gonna, in a spliff. Oh yeah, yeah, because I did hear something about some spliff that he gave someone. Yeah. And it and made them not. get naked. Yeah, yeah. You could put a I don't know what spliff. Sprinkle or something in your spliff. I don't know what spliff they smoke. Yeah, so no, nah, I won't be able to do it, man. Uh-uh. My integrity is more. And all the money in the world. Mm. My soul's more. Yeah. My soul's worth more. I think more. it's easier to say. I think anyone will say that. I'm not saying you. Yeah, no, I know. I'm saying anyone in general, will say that. But say a mill's there on the yeah. table now in cash. Mm. Man's gone. Certain yeah, people. Yeah. Man, man yeah, certain I, don't, I don't I don't know your 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 morals like that. Yeah. But I'm saying if you saw the mills like all up to here and that guys, yeah, 50 no. pound yeah, notes. So majority of men are gone. Sweating. Major, <laughs> major, major, majority of men are gone. Yeah. But yeah. no, uh -uh, that's the not crazy me. world. I wouldn't I'm, be able to live with myself. Yeah, that's that, me. I won't yeah. be able to I won't be able to live with myself. Look in the mirror, I'll yeah. take down all the mirrors yeah, in my house. Depends, isn't it? <laughs> if I if I was gonna do that, I might as well do that, give that to my family and commit suicide. Yeah, yeah. That was my sacrifice. <laughs> that was my sacrifice. You know, them ones yeah. used to live good in it, like, but I can't live with myself after that. No. You know, them ones there. No, for real. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. But to be honest, uh, yeah, I hear you. I'll never do that. But uh, to be honest, I think a lot of the men that do it, they just, I think <laughs> personally, a lot of men that go there, 
They, they go for a conversation. They just get spiked. And then in the morning, it's like... They don't even know. It's a, it's a done deal. Yeah. Hey, uh, here's, here's your footage. Hey, man, what's this hey, blood on my hey, neck, man? Here's your footage. <laughs> you, want, <laughs> you, want, you want to turn away from the game or you want to get, want to get, want to, want to get what we've got for you? Yeah. You've, you've already done it now. Yeah. <laughs> we've got this on you. We've got you anyway, yeah, so yeah, yeah, don't yeah. make sense you going now. You might as well go all <laughs> Might as well, well get your worth now. <laughs> That's mad. That's mad. Yeah, the, yeah, the game, even like I said. You like, think Jake, Jake's on the same thing? Uh, do you know what Drake means? No, tell me. Drake means Dracula, bro. Okay, is that okay, okay, okay. It actually means Dracula. Okay, okay. In mm. um, I forgot, is it Latin? Okay, okay. I was I was I was, mm. I was looking up the other day, I was like, mm. what? Real vampire mm, dog. Mm, 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 you know what I read there? Jake, um all the nail varnish yeah, and yeah, for real. he's, he's been pushing yeah. the thing for a long bruv. Like yeah, he does bare mad free yeah, shit. He's definitely a player in the game, big uh, high, yeah, high Definitely, rolling. yeah. No, nah, I don't player in that yeah. circle. 100%. Yeah, he's got a couple of bangers at any, mm. but if anyone in those multi million pound studios can make bangers. Yeah, they can come you know on. what yeah, I mean? Yeah. You got the best engineers yeah, best in the engineers, world. Definitely. <laughs> Probably got um, um, songs there ready as well. That's just there for you to put Written. on. You know, the ones there. Exactly. Mm. So no, hundred percent. All right, hundred percent, hundred percent. All right, cool. We're gonna wrap it up soon. What you say? And if what, what what the people need to hear from London, what what let's give the message to the people. Give a message to the youths. Give a message to the girl them. Give mm. a message to the man them. First off, though, give a um, funny scenario from me experience growing, um, coming up in the media. Mm. Give me a give me a funny scenario of what's um, experience through the um, your page. Oh shit! There's been so many. <laughs> <laughs> um, give one that's gonna hit. Oh, before you give I gave a couple already. That's you did, what it you is. Did, yeah. you did. You did. You did. You did. You did. Yeah, I can't think of something. Oh, yeah, right, say nothing, say, put the spot on it. say <laughs> nothing, say nothing, say nothing, say nothing. All right. Um, yeah, that one caught me off. Um, we, before you give your message, what do you say about the ch transgender movement getting pushed? With? Um, yeah, that's a good one still because um, on the England kit and the uh, um, Olympics kit, they put in the... Um, I see they put some... some the bisexual flag. Okay, yeah, they, I see, they I see that. They said yeah. the... The St. George's flag, they turned mm. it in. They put the bisexual okay. colour. So obviously, bro, first they done it on the football. And we was, man, I done a video about it. It was mm. cussing. Two weeks later, they're doing it on the Olympics team as well. So obviously it's an agenda. Mm -mm. Who cares about your sex? Mm -mm. I'm not, I don't, anyone, any of you man wearing that England kit, yeah, you're for the agenda. Mm. I just say that. Mm. And if I see any man in that kit, fire upon you, especially mm -mm. if you're influence and you got influence, bro. Mm. Like if you're wearing that kit, you're part of the agenda, bro. Mm -hmm. And you're pushing that on your children. Mm -hmm. Because I just want to watch Olympics with my children and Definitely. be like, fastest runner. Mm -hmm. but not, Oh, he's a lesbian. Yeah, of course. He's gay. Mm. Who cares? Yeah, we come to watch mm. athletics. What's that got I to agree. do with gays and lesbians, bro? I agree. They, do you know what it is? They're making it worse. They make man feel like man's homophobic yep, now. Yep. <laughs> it's true. Man's they're pushing it on man so much. I don't oh, even no, want to see a straight flag on mm, there. Yeah, 100%. No, no flag. No sex. No Forget. sex flag, yeah. If I want no. sex, I watch Pruno. Yeah. I don't want to watch the athletes mm, 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 and be thinking about, oh, mm, mm, oh, they got the straight flag, mm, gay flag. Mm, 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 Leave that alone, man. Because mm, 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 it's the kids they're aiming for, bro. Yeah, and when of you footballers wearing that, see, that's why you know they're all tapped. And mm. you know, in both um, adverts, they had black people in it, like, mm. as the main people. Mm -hmm. I clocked that shit away. They had a, mm -hmm. they had a mixed race girl mm -hmm. and they had a black youth for mm -hmm. the football team. I was mm -hmm. like, that's on purpose. That's all yeah, by design. 100%. Have you noticed when they're ever pushing a bisexual, this LGBT, mm. they always have a, a black yeah, person yeah, in. They make sure there's yeah, a black yeah, person that's what I've, then. That's what I've it's <laughs> like it's getting pushed up. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but if you ask me, it's like it's being pushed to the black community more. Mm, mm. It is. Yeah, I, I would say it's being pushed on children in general. Yeah, children in general. Yeah, yeah 100%. Because you got to realise black, white children look to us mm -hmm. for inference because mm -hmm. we're the rappers, we're yep, the cool yep, ones, yep, isn't yep, it? Yep, yep. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like maybe black children look to white people in the movies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, Like yeah, Superman, yeah, Spider-Man. Yeah, that is true, yeah, that but is true. Yeah. white children look to us, the, the hit, music, cool. Yeah, yeah. You cool. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so mm. I think it's being directed at children mm. in general. Yeah. Like children dead. And white youths, they, like your time's coming with the drill music, bro. Mm -hmm. I see they're pushing this white drill artist mm -hmm. thing as well mm -hmm. now, mm -hmm. just out of nowhere. Because yeah. if you notice about white rappers in mm -hmm. American England, yeah, yeah. Um, 
Say like Eminem, yeah. to this day, if you say name a white rapper in America, you're going to say Eminem, yeah. even though he ain't been relevant for 10 yeah, years. Yeah. Because what they do is they only make one, two or three white rappers be able to get through. Mm -hmm. So they'll get millions of white youth supporting this one rapper. Mm -hmm. So it make him seem like he's better than all yeah, the black rappers, yeah, yeah. but there's mm. only one white rapper to choose from. Mm. So obviously white youths are going to relate yeah, to him course. more. Yeah, yeah. Just like they've done over here with the mm -hmm. Central C. Mm -hmm. Central C, RD, mm. um, what's the other one name? I, H. H, yeah. Yeah, them mm -hmm. three. There's only three, but there's mm -hmm. bare white rappers mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. But they only make a little bit of them get through mm -hmm. so they can make them the top of it. Mm -hmm. So all the local white youths yeah, are supporting yeah, 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 um, yeah. Um, RD or mm, 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 Sench yeah, yeah, so it's gone yeah. crazy because they ain't got no one else in. Mm -hmm. they love rap but there's mm -hmm. no one else representing them mm -hmm. you see what I'm saying yeah, bro it's mad it's the, the science of it is mad when you look at yeah, it yeah they got it all set up yeah mm. yeah crazy 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 alright then cool man in the, in the in the midst of all of this madness and what give a message for the people before we, we before we tap out um, a message for the people. Or tell, <laughs> tell people about you, boss. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, Lon yeah, big up, man. Um, Give all your social accounts, everything, bam, bam. London underscore open underscore TV. Um, yeah, that's that's my Instagram. My TikTok is just London Open TV, all one word. Mm -hmm. And then music pages, um, FOT Raps. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I haven't been focused on my music for the last two years, because I've just been embedded in journalism. Mm -hmm. But this year I want to, yeah, I'm still going to be doing the journalism, but I want to, because I'm getting older now. I just yeah, want to, certain stuff that's in me musically, mm -hmm. I just want to yeah, get out there now. So I just want to, yeah. I just want to push that mm -hmm. this year a mm -hmm. bit more than the journalism. But mm -hmm. my message to people overall is that for my page, when you come onto my page, just take it like you're on BBC or one of them boy there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see, it's journalism, yeah. innit? Yeah. Don't take it too personal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You can I know sometimes I look like I'm mad you online and that, like I'll top man in the face, but we can <laughs> sit down and reason. You get me? Because it's all <laughs> love. Definitely. I, and if, especially if I'm talking about community issues, it's mm -hmm. only because I'm talking about it because mm -hmm. I care. Why would I talk about mm -hmm. it? Man's from the roads, bruv. Mm -hmm. I hate saying that. I hate, I've never said that. That's an exclusive. Mm -hmm. Man's from... <laughs> <laughs> don't Man, like saying that. I don't like saying that. Yeah. But how I grew up, people don't understand. I grew up like certain men were... They came into it in, in secondary school. Mm -hmm. They got influenced by mm -hmm. secondary school. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man was... Born into the streets. Mm -hmm. This is why I'm, I was burning out bad man thing from young. Because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. all the bad man and that used to come to my house. Yeah, of course. So I see all the old school mm -hmm. Brits, man, and see mm -hmm. how their life turned out mm -hmm. from the fuckers mm -hmm. they was pushing. Mm -hmm. So my, even the music game, I had aunties and that was in the music game from the beginning. Okay. The Cookie Crew. Mm -hmm. Then I had my cousin, um, Big Bad Blue, who was okay. doing bear the mixtape mm -hmm. thing. Then I had mm -hmm. other cousins that are in it now. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't even name one of them. He's like mm -hmm. the second biggest artist in the country right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. So when I'm talking about music and community, this is stuff I'm passionate. My mm -hmm. family was a part of, like my auntie was a big part of the Rastafari movement okay. in the UK. Okay. People don't mm -hmm. even know that. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. a lot of stuff I talk about, it's not just an outsider. I was mm -hmm. a radio presenter as well mm -hmm. on Top FM, putting up the rigs back in the day. Okay, okay, so okay. the ends yeah, can yeah. listen to music. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. I'm not just talking about music mm -hmm. and community just as someone willy nilly. Yeah, yeah, like course, I, I was born into it, yeah. the road thing. Born into it, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like seeing police coming in, in, in and out of my house. My brother's mm -hmm. done 15 mm -hmm. years in jail. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I've seen yeah, the ins and outs of jail mm -hmm. and all these things. I've never mm -hmm. been jail. Yeah, yeah. Blessings, mm -hmm. I think, big like up like my facts. big brother. I think that was because mm -hmm. of my brother. He was always like, yeah, you don't want to go to jail, bro. <laughs> like, and I, I see the effects that he had when he went and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So that's one way I give him a big up all the time that he was always like, loud, that is yeah, dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? But yeah, some people, because I present myself as like, conspiracy theorist mm -hmm. kind of thing online. Mm -hmm. They think, oh, you don't know about the road. Mm -hmm. You know, like even when young Tef was talking to me saying, you don't know me. That's what he said. Mm -hmm. He don't know, I know half the men that are around mm -hmm. him. Mm -hmm. But because I don't say, big up this man, yeah, big up that yeah, man, yeah, yeah, big up yeah, that yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, people, yeah. Who, this is what mm -hmm. I don't like about certain people as well. Certain man that was on the road that talk about the road, they talk this, oh, you're not cut from the cloth. <laughs> what fucking cloth? cloth of people that got caught for crimes and went jail. Yeah, Is that a good cloth <laughs> to be cut from? 
I see certain man talk about this cloth like this cloth something good yeah. and it's always jail man and man mm-hmm. that's mad bids that mm-hmm. yeah, they're not cut from the cloth mm-hmm. I don't get that mm-hmm. I, I don't get that cut from the cloth mm-hmm. shit bro because yeah. what cloth what, what the prison cloth mm-hmm. what what the prison bed sheet yeah, what are you talking about bro <laughs> loud that no one's better than nobody yeah, bro I judge man by their energy and yeah. by the love they that's show me I don't be. care if you've been on the road for 10 yeah. 15 years mm-hmm. that little you, you call Niki I think he's got more and more mm-hmm. more Morals than you, and he's mm-hmm. more road than you, mm-hmm. but his integrity's mm-hmm. in place. Yeah, that's you it. Know yeah, what that's I mean? what it comes down to. So, of... yeah, man, big up everyone, man. It's it's all love. When, when I'm talking about certain things, it's coming from a place of love. Mm-hmm. But certain certain time, I channel it, channel it in a certain way, mm-hmm. so the audience hear me. Because if I come and I say, "Hey, we're we, we, too cool, yeah, nice," yeah, no yeah. one don't hear that, boss. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, they want to hear that passion. Yeah, a bit of character. Yeah, yeah, you know what character. I mean? I'm playing a character yeah. online. Mm-hmm. You know, like when the duo I say they're playing a character. <laughs> it's all a lie. I'm lying to you, bro. It's all an illusion. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't need to take it too personal. Don't take it too personal. It's just a character. You uh, know, hundred <laughs> percent. Yep. All right. All good. So we all good. We got everything out there. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. All right, like people, you don't Whoosh. know, we out. Big up London Open TV. Make sure you go check them out. Your boy Flash, Truth and Bats, we out. Black. Oof.